Hello and a very good afternoon, good morning, welcome to Crafters TV. My name is Ben Mosby and I'm delighted to be back. Thank you, producer Johnny, he's just given me a big hearty welcome back in my ear. Uh, this is my first show back here for three weeks, can you? <laughs> Three weeks. Three weeks. Three We're giving weeks. Him all that time off. Uh, uh, shh. Uh, shh. a second. Let me just say, and before we before we start, we'll be talking about you in a second. Before we start, for those of you who go, oh, he's such a part time. Oh, he's <laughs> I've been moving house. So it's not as if I've been sat on a beach somewhere for three. I've been non-stop moving house, DIYing, gardening. I mean, I've come back to work for the rest, if I'm being honest <laughs> with you. Uh, but thank you for all the lovely messages that you sent me. Did a few videos over the last few weeks of me new house and that. So thank you for all the warm wishes. And I am glad to be back. And I am pleased to be back on this day because first show back straight into a launch day uh, with a collection which I know you guys have been really looking forward to. Uh, the triptych dies, uh, which come to you in a Christmas theme and also an air everyday theme as well. You'll have seen these earlier on on Wake Up Call, I am sure. Uh, no doubt, if you were watching earlier on, you probably already got your hands on these as well. If you haven't, we'll be explaining them all in full over the course of the next couple of hours. They really are amazing, allowing you to create uh, that beautiful sort of trio of arch windows, and then you've got all these different scenes uh, that you can create behind as well. Now, um, I just wanted to give you an overview on that before I introduce you to um, our fabulous guest who uh, you've already caught a sneak peek of. Now, as you know, um, I like to be quite dapper when I'm here on uh, Crafters TV. I like to be smart. I like to wear a nice shirt, waistcoat, sometimes a bow tie, sometimes a smart jacket as well. It pays to be smart when you're on live TV. Um, Sara, you look great today. Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's not what he said he was going to do for the open of the show. <laughs> <laughs> yes, guys, so I'm right in the middle of my Strictly Come Dancing oh, training, that thing. and because this was such a big launch, I was insisting I had to be here to do the launch today at 3 o'clock. It's 3 o'clock here in the UK, but for those of you watching us all around the world. Um, so I made my pro get up at 5 o'clock this morning, train with me from 6 till 1. Wow. I was supposed to go home at 1, have a shower, wash my hair, put a dress on, <laughs> put the eyelashes on, turn up, ready for TV, and it all went to pot. I had to do a radio interview instead. Yep. I came running in here 15 minutes ago, still in my dance gear, still haven't had a shower, still all sweaty, dancing around, and I was like, right, it's all right, no, guys, I'm here, ready for the launch. <laughs> so uh, you're just going to have to take me as I am, and I have a feeling this kind of might be the story of my life now for the next few weeks. You're just going to have to take me as I am. If I'm stealing for a few hours between training, I will absolutely be here. I'm not missing any of the big launches, but you're going to have to just... Well, no eyelashes. We are Do one... On Saturday night if you want to see all the fancy hair and the eyelashes and the frocks, guys. You ain't going to see it here for the next few We months. are one big family here, so if you want to turn up looking like that... Um, <laughs> it's, it's absolutely fine. We love you, whether you're all glam or all... Greasy. Hey, uh, anyway, I've got a big <laughs> smile on Ben. I've got a big smile on my T-shirt, a big smile on my face. So anything else is good. <laughs> well, it's lovely to have you here with us, Sarah. You and, look uh, a bit red there, Ben. Hey, what? A bit red there. Me? You look a bit blushed. No, I'm fine. I've just um, it's been all the uh, work I've been doing out in the. Uh, the garden, the tan, it's the, the northern weather, the northern weather. Anyway, let's get back down to business and uh, tell us, please, about this amazing collection. I know you've got the boards over there to go through. Uh, we saw a sneak peek of this earlier on on um, Wake Up Call. Uh, we are approaching a fifth of the stock already. This is flying out the door, Sarah. Well, I know the thing is, Ben, that's because it is a brand new twist on an age-old slam dunk. I know you guys love it. So let me start with this one here, right? So. Creator cards. You know creator cards are like our number one best-selling dies, Ben. What a triptych die is, it's a creator card split across three panels. So instead of telling the story in one, it tells the story in three. Mm. Now, the beauty of that is, Ben, it means you can put them on a card like this, like you would a creator card, or you can take them and you can use them on smaller surfaces yeah. all together. You can use just a couple of them. You can use all three of them. You, there, there are so many more options, so much more flexibility. Plus, you know the most popular card size worldwide trending at the moment, Ben, are those lovely slimline cards. Yeah. These are made the perfect size to fit on those slimline cards. So that's what Triptych is. I've, we've got six designs in the collection. Do you want me to walk everybody through? Oh, yes, them? please. Right, Let's have a look at them all. On. So actually, right, here we go. I showed you. 
I know she's my favourite. You know I love a good nativity scene, man. You know I love the kind of real meaning of Christmas dyes. That is your nativity scene, okay, guys? This is the die itself. Now, because they're creator cards, obviously you can cut them into the card or cut them out. That is them cut in. This is them just cut out on a panel, mm -hmm. and you get all three of these dies, right? Ben will take you through later about like getting them individually. Don't be ordering them individually, guys. Just trust me, you're going to be gutted when you see all my demos, and I'm going to show you all of them, right? Right, staying on the Christmas theme, Ben. Staying on that Christmas theme, and now we're telling the story of Santa flying over the rooftops across that triptych. Now, if you take out Santa, it's just a beautiful village scene. Yeah, yeah. If you take, if you cut out all the stars and the moon, it's a village daytime scene. It is. Can you see the flexibility mm. we've built into it, right? Now, there's them two. There's also a third Christmas one, which those of you who were shopping on HSN earlier will not have seen. Oh, okay. This third one, HSN did not order this. These were on HSN earlier this week. Congratulations to the thousands of you that picked them up. You'll have been waiting for this show today. And um, you might want to get these two extras that I'm going to show you that were not the HSM buyers did not select, but we've got them available here if you want to just go for them. We'll get the multi buy details up for you. So you've got this gorgeous Christmas cottage scene. And I'm saying Christmas, you could easily just, and this is how we've designed them all, Ben, take out that tree, yeah. take out these Christmas ornaments. It's not Christmas anymore. It just becomes everyday. It really tons mm. of flexibility, okay? Right? So I'll pop the details. That's the quaint village. There it is on there. We've put two for on a special deal because there are two that are exclusively available. Uh, well, I'm saying exclusively available that haven't been made available, that were available through HSN. Those of you who ordered. By the way, if you ordered them earlier this week, please let me know in the comments because I want to know if people have started receiving them yet, what you think of them, okay? Now, Fourth option one is this one here. This is the other one that you won't find on HSN. So if you're wanting to go for two of these together on the two for deal, this is the other one, right? So the details are coming in now for this one. That's you called your charming church, right? Ben, wedding cards. Absolutely right. Anniversary cards, mm. christening cards, you know, so many. Anytime you want a beautiful church scene, this is it. But it's also this Victorian church scene built into there, right? That is your fourth option, right? Now... We all love fairies, right? And the fairies, yeah. if I just pull in this card here, okay? This is what we're talking about. So can you see what we've done is we've kind of taken the bird all the way through this. Yeah. And then put the couple of fairies in. Now, I brought them out in a different colour in that card. Doesn't I'm saying I have? I have it. It's one of Hannah's absolutely gorgeous cards there. Hannah, that's a beautiful card. I just think picking out the fairies there just elevated that next level, Ben. That is it there. But bear in mind, you could take out the fairies if you just wanted that beautiful bird on the branch and it didn't want to be mystical with the fairies. And then lastly, can you see why we weren't choosing, Ben? Lastly, is that gorgeous woodland scene. Super cute. Now, we've done a woodland style scene. Now, the Magical Forest, we've done this in like a creator card style. We've brought them in edgeables. Every time, it's an absolute winner. So, to have that in the triptych, and these are the only triptych dies we're launching this year, guys. I mean, this is it. If you love this theme, I'm just telling you now, this is us doing that brand. It's a brand new concept for us. It's kind of bringing together creator cards with that slim line effect that's really popular but giving it a new t a new twist with the three-part series on there i've got absolutely tons of demos you are going to love these when you see them put into action hopefully you've kind of got a feel of what it is now should i kind of start get ready for the first demo ben absolutely and listen you need to get checking out your baskets early on because already uh, we are at a, approaching a fifth of the stock has gone lots of you bought earlier on on wake up call lots of you have been buying in between the shows as well and certainly if you um I've already shopped with this on HSN. Make sure you get those two uh, CTV exclusives as well because you can get those on that multi-buy as well. But it's a wonderful, wonderful collection. And again, that you will see so many different ways to use them. Uh, you saw a bit of a sneak peek with our Craig a little bit earlier on, but lots of demos to come with Sarah over the course of this show. This is the deal for you. Launching it today here on Crafters TV should be over £93, uh, over $107. Look at the price today. Everybody saving $20.94 or $23.74, uh, bringing it down to $72.99 or $83.95. 20% off further if you're platinum. That is 
a remarkable deal, £58.39 or $67.16. Uh, and again, what I love with this is the fact that they are so, so super uh, versatile. Once again, you'll notice with the deal as well, we are going to be throwing in some of your heat resistant acetate because these, again, are going to be perfect uh, for things like your boxes to create that uh, window effect. So that's going to be super to be able to use those for that. Uh, but yeah, even like if you want to use these for sort of like that stained glass window effect as well, just amazing. But for the likes of creating um, your boxes again, um, we were talking um, a lot about this very recently, you know, Christmas time uh, to be able to kind of match up your cards um, with your boxes as well. That's what you've got the ability to do with these. But the fact that you've got the acetate in there as well allows you to be able to create um, those beautiful boxes. I love as well the fact that you've got so much snippability with these as well. So like Sarah was saying, you know what? Yes, you have got a quaint like Christmas village there, but if you wanted to snip out the Christmas tree, all of a sudden uh, you've got a village for all year round. Lots of different ways to be able to use these as well. I like the fact that we've also included um, Christmas cards and uh, we've uh, included kind of all year rounds as well. And look at this, not just for cards as well, but inside the little box here, you can make these into little tags as well, which I just think uh, is absolutely gorgeous. So certainly lots of different ways to be able to use these. You don't always have to use them uh, in that triptych effect. You don't always have to go, uh, you know, side by side by side. Lots of different ways to be able to use them, as is always the case with the products that we bring you. Lots of different ways. The versatility is key with these. Uh, what I will point to as well, just again, as Tara has already mentioned, uh, the multi-buy, if you've already got four of these, uh, don't forget those two that you won't have got um, off HSM. You've got the Charming Church and that quaint village as well. Uh, so details there, they're all $14.99 or $16.95 individually. Uh, there's your platinum price. But then of course, if you want to go for the two, so you've got the quaint village and you know, you also got in there the, um, uh, the charming church, get those on the two for two for 26 pounds or two for $30 um, is the deal there. Lots of you saying hello. I shall respond to you in just a few moments time, but I did just want to bring back uh, to your attention that back in stock, this literally when we had when we had this in stock originally i want to say that this flew out in like days it absolutely it did it, it was was it a day a couple of days the gossy highlights uh, hardly any of you basically getting it because it was so so fast out the doors i am pleased to say that the glossy highlights are now back in stock get them while they're here uh, because i have a feeling they're not going to last uh, for very long this time either. £5.99 or $6.95, um, or if you're platinum, $4.79, $5.56. Um, I would multi-order this if I were you because um, we wouldn't want you to miss out a second time on it. So get a few bottles of this. And whilst we're just talking about your glossy highlights, right about that five pound mark, it is, as we all know, Fiverr Friday. <laughs> what does that mean? Well, it means it's Friday and we've got lots of deals for our Fiverr, yes. If you go to our website right now, uh, you'll be able to have a look at selected deals that you'll be able to pick up just for today, just for the 24 hours at, at five pounds, five dollars. So have a look, fill up those baskets, get those deals whilst they're here for Fiverr Friday. Uh, lots of people already watching. We are so, so busy already. Um, Kimberly just saying, good morning, everyone. Greetings from North Carolina. Peg says, we missed you, Ben. I missed you guys too. Uh, morning all from California, says Katie. Uh, good morning, says, Alicia to everyone I ordered these on HSN I can't wait to get them don't forget to pick up the other two that you haven't already got uh, Alicia best of luck to you Sarah our dancing queen uh, Kathy says hi from Arizona welcome back Ben and good luck Sarah uh, and hi everyone says Caroline <laughs> I love Sarah's top says uh, says Caroline she's been dancing like she's not dressed up don't be saying that you love her outfit today she's in her dance stuff Seriously, she's not. Oh, look at the move there. I washed the hair. The Do you know what? I was on Channel 5 this morning as well here in the UK on the Jeremy Vine show. Just like that? And they had to do, yeah. <laughs> ben, you can't, you can't see it. You can't. That's one of those moments where you might think it, Ben, but you're no, supposed to it. engage the brain. I've got no. dressed like that. No, I didn't mean it like that. It came out. Let me say it again. Oh, were you, what, you, so you were wearing that outfit? You look great, you look very smart. You look, sorry, if you were to walk in here in a trash bag, I would still think that you look great. Ben, 
still going, still going, mate. Right. <laughs> so maybe we'll just move it on. Move it on, right. And yes. actually do a demo, should we? We should. <laughs> right, we okay, should. guys. So I'm going to start off. You know that card I was showing you? This one here, right? I took inspiration from this one, but I thought we'd change up the designs, but I'd show you how to do this sort of concept, which is where it's got the dome across the front, okay? Mm. And what I'm going to do, Ben, is I'm going to show you how to do that one, then I'll walk you through all of the concepts, because when you see all the different ones you can make, you'll be like, wow, all of that just with that one set of dies. Yeah. Well, one set. You'll want all six by then, folks, as well. But even if you just only bought one set, you could do all the cards I'm going to show you, okay? So for a dome-fronted card, what I've done, Ben, is, and you can do this with any size, right? I've started with a sheet of A4. So if you want to do with eight and a half by 11, it's exactly the same, and it's just folded in half. Then I've matted and laid a piece of watercolour card to go over the front. Okay. Right? Then your second piece of card needs to be the same depth. You're going to have to cut this down from your A4. Same depth, but can you see it's the width plus an extra three quarters of an inch either side. So that what you then do, Ben, is you take this and wrap it around that watercolour and that's what gives you the bow front. Got yep. you. Uh -huh. And I'm going to give you some great tips for sticking your bow front onto your flat card on here on the on the front there, right? So that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to start off putting my triptych dies in the middle here. And I'm going to work with that beautiful nativity scene, okay? So you've got the three dies. And the whole idea is if you just want to use two, you just want to use one, brilliant. Mm. But they work fantastically well as a three. So I'm going to line them up on my card. Now, I'm just doing this by eye. By eye, as our Debbie would say, eye. right? However, if you wanted to do it and take a little bit more time and be a bit more precise, just remember, guys, you won't be on live TV with the producer shouting in your ear, come on, five more minutes for this demo. That's what it sounds like as well, Johnny. to the next one if you want to get all six done. <laughs> that, guys, is our <laughs> lovely Johnny. <laughs> That's yes. what we have to live with day in, day out. Yes. Yeah, it just sounds like that. Five yeah. minutes left. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting higher. <laughs> right, mm. so there are my triptych dies. Then I'm going with the clear, then the magnetic, then the top plate, right, straight through. Now, notice I'm using the large Gemini, Ben. These dies fit through your Gemini Junior as well. So yeah. they'll work with any one of your die cutting machines, right? I just find it's going to give me a little bit more flexibility mm. and make my life easier on the shorter day doing it on the larger platform. Those of you that have the Pro, even better. So you're going to have even more flexibility. It's all about positioning with these cards, guys, right? So here we go. I'm going to leave them on there, right? While we're there, Ben, I will, however, take off my where's my pokey tool where's my pokey tool here's my pokey tool right here's my pokey tool uh, i will take off them little bits of sellotape now what i'm going to do ben is i'm just going to tip this under here right take that off and use one of my midas ink pads uh -huh. and we're going to go and just put the little bit just give it a bit of a shine around the outside oh okay oh clever, clever. yeah right okay go on that's your cue to talk while i do all of this all right well um i can tell you I can tell you. <laughs> I know you've had three weeks off, Ben, but just in case you'd forgotten. Do you know forgot what? No. What it was like working with Sarah. No, no do you know what? I, <laughs> I, I love that because we've been working together, well, a year, probably, when did we do our first show together? Probably two years. And still, every time, that's your cue to talk. <laughs> I know! You don't have to. I know, I'm trying to make you look cool. Nobody else tells me that. I can do it. Do you know? you to, no, Debbie or, it doesn't go, no, it's your damn dark, Ben. She, I, she just stops and then I. <laughs> I she just in. stops and you're reading it and you're like, oh, I'm up, I'm up. I'm yeah, going to get well, working edgeways now. Anyway, uh, let me just read a few comments because it's now my time to talk. You can shine now, Ben. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> oh, <shush. laughs> Why is she like today, honestly? You're still high Sorry. on that dancing juice I, or yeah, something. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's like, I think... And I only had three hours sleep, Ben, because yeah. I was, I couldn't. I don't know how you're doing it. It was the, it was like, I did go to bed, I went to bed at half past nine, um, but I was, just couldn't sleep. I was just like, duh, duh, step in me head, step in me head. Were you dancing in bed? Step, learning, I was just learning the steps over and over in me head. Yeah. And then I was like, I need to go to sleep, I need to go to sleep. And then our Oliver came and climbed into bed with us at three o'clock this morning. I was like, that is not what I needed when I just got to sleep an hour ago, but love you, son, love you. <laughs> Always so, the way, um, though, isn't yeah. it? Always the way. Um, lots of people loving um, loving the uh, triptych dies. Uh, Kathy is saying, Sarah, uh, you're dressed the way I am every morning as I watch Crafters TV. Nice. I feel I feel right at home today. 
Well, we say like on a Friday, maybe, you know, I'm not saying that Sarah looks dressed down, but you know, like, dress down Friday, you know, maybe that should be a thing and I'll come in wearing me, me joggers. Yeah, but um, I think next time I'm doing a show to Wednesday, Ben, so what's it, dress down Wednesday? We could have a, um, yeah, uh, 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 wear what you want Wednesday, Wear Thank what you, you want Wednesday, nice. Johnny, that's good. Well, well rescued. We, we, Thanks, yep. producer Johnny. I don't want you all to think Ben came up with that line. Uh, oh, why am I this? <laughs> I've got you in a deal, haven't I? Uh, pa <laughs> I knew it was be one of those days because the way like Sarah just arrived, sort of burst through the door. She was dancing around, come straight <laughs> in like a like a whirlwind. She's not stopped. It's going to uh, be a long hour and forty minutes. Right, you've missed your moment because I finished. Oh, I didn't get chance to say anything. <laughs> did you read any comments? I did one. <laughs> right. Um, okay. So, can you see how good that look? Oh, I didn't mean to get mess on the end there, but they're, they're going to stick underneath. How good does that look with that shine around the outside? I've messed up there. Watch what I'm going to do when I've messed up there, Ben. Right? Mm -hmm. We're going to fix it. We're going to fix it by just giving it a bit of a smoosh over. When you're doing it, guys, you won't be live on TV working at the speed of light. Now, this one here, bit of watercolour card, Ben. Just to save time, I've used my inks and I've just coloured over. Now, this could be... I've done it here with my um, alcohol ink. No, I haven't. I've done it here with my water-based inks, sorry. You could be using any sort of inks you want. You could be using your sparkle pens, anything, right? You just want colour in the background. Now, to stick this round the back bend, a couple of tips for you here, right? You're going to go tape to tape to give it a better stick. Yes. So tape down the edge here, tape down the edge there. And in here, we're going to tape down the edge up here and here, right? And then up here and up here. And then all we're doing is we sealing these two together like this, right? So line that up. Oh, so that, look at this. This is going to be go, awesome. And then once that's lined up, there's my first one. Yeah. All lined up, just dropping it down. I'm trying to do it kind of for the camera. So, so can you see I've got it lined up? Then I'm just at this point dropping it down so that that will tuck under and we've got that bow front. Love that's, it. That's how you kind of get the perfect bow front. Now, next thing I want you to do, stick it onto the base of that card, right? And best thing to use is your wet glue. So you either your tacky glue if you need a quick tack, or what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use my um, all-purpose so that I've got a little bit of manoeuvrability on the base there, right? Oh, got glue all over. Right, so there's that onto the base there just manoeuvring that into place and i'm going to give that a couple of minutes to dry ben before i stand it up on the table yeah and then all i'm going to do to finish it off is i've literally got lovely little sentiment seasons greetings beautiful and let's have a little think i think we'll put that on with a little bit of 3d glue gel yeah a little bit of 3d get the glue chunky gel. glue out get the chunky oh who hasn't put the lid on the chunky glue oh that's that's oh, the one that was you know, the you know, faulty guys, earlier so, on so this one here right what you're supposed to do is don't ever put the lid on with air in. You're supposed to squeeze it, it out so a little bit comes out the top and mm. then it doesn't go hard in here. Who's that been? Who's that Do you want bean? one? I've got one over here, I think. You, oh, oh, you oh, he's got all the gear. Here we go. Look, I've got, I've got some. Are you, you sorted? Right. I'm, well, I'm always sorted, Ben. Have you seen how much gubbins we've got down here? Yeah? I, I never get to go that side, right. but I can imagine. You've never, <laughs> you've never been loud on this bit. <laughs> no, yeah. let me over there. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm just going to put a couple of little bits here, watch. So this is, uh, uh, this just so you know, it d looks a little bit different to that 3D glue gel. This is actual silicon. So quite often I don't use silicon because I don't like the smell and I don't like the yellowing. However, that's what we've got. So we're using silicon, it's just, it works in the same sort of way, right? There we go. So that there Bad. is going to be perfect and that is giving you that lovely base. So. That is the kind of basic way to do it. Now, what's first, Ben? Are you going to give them what the options are or am I going to show them in concept suite? Um, well, let me, let, yes, let me run through the options and well, then you can do the concept suite. Let me get tidied up with them and yeah, then and I'll, I'll go through the concept suite. I'll read out a few of the comments as well, seeing as I didn't get a chance to uh, last time when it was my turn uh, before. Too slow, you snooze, you lose. Uh, oh, MG says, Patty, Sarah, we love how real you are. Uh, you look awesome for all the running around you've been doing. I mean, fair play. Uh, I've always said it about Sarah. She fits into 24 hours, uh, what most of us do in 48 hours. I don't know how she does it. Stops time, I think. Um, and We've got a board I'm... meeting after this, you know. Eh? We've got a US, US board meeting tonight. We've Have you really? Yeah, about 7 to the 11, you know. No, no rest for the wicked. No rest for the I mean, squeezing tea with the kids in between. Seriously, this is what I mean. Like how on, how on earth? How on earth? 
Uh, hello everyone, says Nefertiti. My order is on its way, I can't wait. Good morning everyone, says Stephanie. Welcome back, Ben. Hello, Sarah. I've just ordered the two sets that I did not get from HSN, says Wanda. My order from HSN is shipped, so maybe they will arrive on the same day. And that is a good point, actually, Wanda. Uh, there are the two, two items. Uh, the two items that you won't have seen on HSN. Uh, so let's show you those. Wanda, perfect, you see. Seamless, we move into these. These two here, so we've got uh, your Charming Church, so this one exclusive to us here on CTV. You can get that individually if you want to, but what I would say to you is, if you are like Wanda uh, and you've got the ones on HSN, get this other one as well, which is your Quaint Village, because then you can uh, save even more money and get them on a two for 26 or two for $30 deal so those are the two that you won't have seen before those two of course then also go in that full collection for you as well uh, where you get i mean these are just so beautiful what i love about them as well is the snippability the fact if you want to be able to run these through maybe a couple of three times you can then create the layers on the outside as well to build up uh, the depth you know if you want to multi-cut these um add the, the the depth of the trees the deer on the front that's the possibilities that you've got as well that is your magical woodland uh, this one here are your beautiful fairies um, again showing you that you have got lots of um, sort of christmas themed dies here but again ones that you can use year round round two this is my favorite and actually i think a lot of the over the rooftop scenes that we've done um in the um launches that we've done over the um the sort of christmas period here i've loved this theme and i also love with this the fact that you do get that extra die of uh, father christmas there that you can pop on the outside or maybe pop on the inside of the car just really creating that beautiful scene effect and then the last set uh, that you get uh, is the Oh Holy Night, uh, which is your nativity scene. Um, again, all of those are included in that bundle for £58.39 if you're platinum, or $67.16. And listen, we're 25 minutes into the show, um, a quarter of the stock has already gone. Bear in mind, again, when we do these launch days, we always have a big stock. So the fact that we're shouting at you, a quarter of the stock has already gone, now is the time to jump in. G get the full collection today, or as I said, if you've already got elements of this, um, go for the multi by go for individuals so if you're not quite sure you can dip your toe in the water but i can guarantee if you do go for an individual you'll be coming back to get the rest of these after uh, so take the plunge and grab these now super easy to use um, and uh, super super versatile as well which we'll see with sarah in just a few moments time when we have a look um, at that um uh, sweet, which kind of goes through all of the different ways that you can use these. Also, just to show you um, other great deals that we've got on the show, really busy storage. I think loads of you uh, recently been thinking, yeah, need to get sorted. I think Debbie Robinson kind of started this off, didn't she? When she tidied up her craft room, got it all sorted out, and then people were going, yeah, yeah, could do with some more storage, could do with some more ways of getting everything uh, spick and span. Uh, we've got your um, Karen 5x7 storage collection. This is just for illustration purposes, uh, the kind of things that we popped inside ours. But I love these, you guys love them too. The fact that you've got that plastic sort of inner shell there to keep everything together. I mean, you can get loads in there. Um, and also the fact with these that they're see-through, they're wipeable, you've got that hook and mesh system so you can pop these away nice and easily. And they're also super portable too. We're also going to throw into the deal um, your stamp storage pockets as well. So you're gonna get five of those included. Again, if you wanna pop your dies in there, uh, if you wanna get your stamps nice and organized as well, lots of ways to be able to do that. And you can see that you can label these up too so if it has been uh, a bit of a resolution of yours to get things sorted get tidied uh, then this is a great way to go it's a 25 percent saving uh, that you're going to make on that uh, plus 20 percent off uh, platinum is six pounds 39 or seven dollars and 59 cents thank you for all the lovely comments coming through and um, we're loving the fact that so many of you are loving these uh, new triptych dies uh, allison's in from westlake village in california uh, renee says so happy to see you back Ben Sarah I love your t-shirt uh, I'm hoping I can find Strictly Come Dancing for I want to watch you dance um, there's a video doing the round somewhere of um, Sarah and I doing a little bit of a, a oh, yeah. have you come on I'm, since then if I do well on the show he's going to be like it's because I taught her some steps it was, that's what, say, do you know what that was when that was just before you went off on holiday wasn't it that was the last time I saw you yeah I was like I, that's, that's the thing you see I you know I, I always like to sort of set Sarah on the you know the right the right way so like when we did the running and stuff I, I helped Sarah get <laughs> help Sarah no I helped no, no, Sarah no, 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 get no, 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 who helped who with the running no well who you helped, who said he hadn't run in years yeah 
and drag and then who dragged who out for yes. the first time. Ha, ha, Granted, then you pretty much dragged me around every race right after that. No, but here's the thing: you did the initial kind of like, "Come on, get out of bed. What are you doing?" kind of thing. Let's go running at five in the morning, and then I and then I did the let's get your PBs, and I got you a yes, couple he's, of PBs. He's, he's right there. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna give him that. He did. Ben, ben owns most of my PB times. Cause yes. He, um, I, like I said, I'm right. Ben on the doorstep, half past five. Yeah. We're running. Yeah. And then he's like, if I'm here and I've yeah, got out of bed, yeah. we're running fast. Yeah. And it's like the same with the dancing. It's like, well, if, if, you know, if you're going to do Strictly, I'm going to get in there first and show you a few steps. You know, you get your professional, whatever. But I was in there. I planted the seed. So when you go on and if you pick up the bit of ball, you can thank me in the speech at the end and oh, all that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah. Who needs some, you know, multiple dance champion winning <laughs> however many times? That's what they have to do to get on this show. Yeah. Win multiple dance worldwide competitions <laughs> over and over again to get onto that show. But you know, no, it's all about Ben. It's all about Ben. <laughs> and he's three jive kicks because that's all he had to give us that day. We just did it in loads of different places around the building so it looked different. <laughs> anyway. Uh, let's stop talking about uh, dancing and uh, sorry, let's have a look at the concept suite, uh, what we can do with these triptych dyes. Moving swiftly on. <laughs> 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 You're all right, you're going to have a mouthful of your tea as well if you want. Oh, did they not make you one? No, I didn't get one. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, sorry, didn't get the memo. I didn't get one. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We will settle down in a bit. I absolutely promise. I was all right till you I came in. I don't promise. I don't promise. Right, here we go. So, basic stepper card, right? Basic card, Ben, just tenfold with a bit on the bottom, and all we've done is the cutout bits have gone back on again. Fantastic. How many times have you seen me do a centre step? How amazing is that centre step when you pop the three triptych dies across in the middle? And just so you all know, that is 10 inches wide. So it's done from a sheet of A3 cardstock or your 12 by 12, okay? Now, I love easels. You mm -hmm. know, I absolutely love easels. There is your easel card, Ben, just like we normally do, right through. So cut through the front and back. So you've seen me do I've demoed this one so many times here on Crafters TV, but I think it's another mm. level when you do it with the triptych. Now, it's exactly the same if we want to go and do, what about a card like this, Ben? So this one here is where the base card is slightly smaller than the back card, so that you get that kind of where it folds in in the middle. We're liking it. Yeah. Yeah. If you do that five times back to back, Ben, that gives you one of these. I'm sure they've got a technical name and I don't know what they are, right? Oh, these that's brilliant. Are those where you've got like a smaller one inside the bigger one. Yeah. And you just need like a different colour in the background. It really makes it stand out. So if anybody knows what they're called, I call them a star book if I put mm. a pop out, but I don't know if this is a pop out, right? So you can see though the kind of star shape yeah. that you get from that one. Nice. Let's nice director socials. Charlotte, nailed it. Excellent. She says, no problem, guys, she's on it. Right. This one, I loved. I'm going to do this as a demo for you Ooh. in a little while, right? So that one there is just a double fallback gatefold. Let me know if you want to see that one sooner rather than later. I've planned a shaker card next, but we can move on to one of these as well. Uh, now, I did talk about pop-outs. Pop-outs are perfect. And I mean, this is like cut right over the centre fold of that pop-out bed with the two side panels. How awesome is that? Amazing. Uh, how many of you have been making loads of gift bags since we've done them tutorials recently? How awesome does the That's gift bag fab. look with the whole scene in the gift bag? Yeah. And then do you know what I would be doing, Ben? Instead of putting the black card behind, bit of acetate, nice tissue wrapped paper in there. Love Beautiful. It. Right, make sure you emboss your tissue paper as well, guys. If we're doing it, we're in for a penny, in for a pound. Right. This is the three separate panel panels all pulled up, right? This one here, oh, so this is our easel. Oh, we've seen the easel card. Let's have a look. We've got some of these in twice, haven't we? Right. Yes, that one's in twice. Right, here we go. This here is just your panel, but with another one behind it, right? So it's just got two behind it there, Ben, just kind of off-centred, right? Oh, okay. We've got the ones where, what about this? What about a screen card? Nice. Very well, nice. it's just in three panels on a screen card. Looks yep. quite classy, right? Uh, shaker card. We're doing a shaker card next. Yes, please. I know we don't talk about the four snow very much, but if you've got the four snow guide, it's going to be perfect for your shakers. Uh, here is a pop out card like the other one that I just showed you, Ben, but with all three panels inside the pop. Whereas before, we had one and one Two. either side. Yeah. Love that idea. Uh, your easel cards, you know how you can do them? It's wow. like a tent fold easel. Yeah. I love the tent. That is my. That's one of my all-time favourite cards now. It's right up there, Ben, with a Z fold. Believe Seriously? it or not. Yeah, yeah, it's right up there with me Z folds. Uh, right, here we go. You've got uh, the side fold back ones. Oh, that's cool. 
You've got things like your diorama cards. There's so many on there. So many <laughs> options. So, there's your diorama card on there. Yeah. Not just about cards. These would be brilliant in the front of a box. Yep. So you could be doing your boxes with these. Uh, what about doing, I'm going to do one of these for you as well here. Little tea light holders. Cute. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Or instead of just three sides, go six sides. Because obviously you've got your triptych. So you can put the same one round three times. How immense does that she look? That's pretty good. That is the bomb.com then isn't it the bomb.com the bomb.com right there perfect right that is your concept suite i'm going to get ready and do a shaker card though but i've got loads more techniques to show you guys honestly i promise you it's going to be a brilliant show uh, there's loads of comments coming through. We are now at a quarter of the stock has gone. In fact, just over a quarter. Loads of you going for this. Lots of you going for the multi-buy as well. Get the full collection though. That's where the main value for money is. Um, and the fact that you've got these uh, to use year round as well. You've got some more Christmas themed ones, but certainly uh, some everyday triptych dies in there. And as we've seen, the way that you can manipulate these and, and cut into these as well, uh, you can make these for whatever occasion you want them to be for. Lots of love for that last demo. Looking so pretty, says Pam, love the background on that, says Kathy. Uh, Vicky, beautiful background, Sarah. Um, and Marianne just saying, we love you as you are, Sarah. You look beautiful whether you wear it. Uh whether you wear what you're wearing, but I loved you in your sparkly dress. Um, Christine says, oh, hang on a minute. Someone's told me what to say. Wait there. Wait right, there. Come on, I'm listening. Wait there. Wait there. Here it is. Oh, no. Uh, oh, where? Here we go. Oh, uh, 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 Sarah, you look so good. You make casual Friday look Givenchy. Oh, hey. Now that, Ben is what you should have said. Yeah. That's what you should have said. Thank you, Sarissa. Thank you. Yeah, you make Casual Friday look... What is it? Is that right? Is that, is that right? Givenchy. Jivan, yeah. Good stuff. Anyway, um, <laughs> there's questions coming in as well. I'll tell you what I'll do. We'll do a little question and answer session in just a few moments' time uh, once we set Sarah off on our next demo. The other thing, just to throw your way as well, the glossy highlights, which you guys are absolutely loving, is flying out of the door as well. Uh, w w well, when we first had this, it flew out of stock about as quickly as we had it in stock. How, yeah, how long has it been since we've had this? Uh, we have now got it back. It's going to go again. Get it now. Get it once, twice, thrice, four times over, £5.99 or $6.95. Um, platinum price on this £4.79 or $5.56 if you're a Club Inspire member. Um, as I say, thank you for all the questions coming in. I'm aware of those and we will um, we'll do a little question and answer session once we get Sarah started uh, on our next demo as well. But basically, loads of you chatting how much you love this deal. Uh, Mon Monkey Head Bonkers saying, I ordered these and I'm so excited. And Pammy on YouTube, Wowzers Trousers, that is a good deal. Uh, wow, the trousers, yes. Let us um, move back on then and get looking at another demo. And I think we're going to, are we going to do the shaker card here then, Sarah? We're going to do the shaker card. Got a couple of great shaker cards. I can't help it. Everything's going to be a dance, a dance now. now, isn't it? Everything's going to be a dance. A uh, couple of good shaker card tips for you as well, guys, right? So here we go. Love the stag. Love the stag. But to me, it feels very wintry. So I thought we'd make it not feel wintry. And not, it's called Magical Forest. Let's take the magical and we'll leave it in the forest. But we'll take the magical <laughs> kind of feel out of it, right? Yeah. You'll know what I mean. I know, I know what you then, mean. Right? He knows what I mean, right? So here we go. One, two, three, right? Now, again, if you, I mean, you can, if you want, position them on your magnetic mat and then take them. But I personally like to just do it like this because I find you can eyeball it really easily, Ben. Yeah. You Whilst you're doing this as well, question from Kelly. She's asking about the, the widths of the die. So she's saying that she wants to mix and match the That's scenes. A, yes, work. absolutely. Yep, they're all, they all have different tops. Yeah. But they're all the same size die. Right. right. So that you can absolutely mix and match them or make bigger projects that use several of them in one go if you want. And also to answer Cindy's question, um, she's just saying, do the triptych triptych set, this is so hard to say, do they fit separately through the mini? I've sent the mini to my niece and I need to know she may cut them out. Um, I think the answer to that question is yes, they, they are, do. They do indeed, but let me just show you so you know. Mm. Um, there we go. Comfortable, guys, comfortable. Right? Yep. There um, we've got great deal on the mini we as well, guys. We'll show you that later. Right, here we go. So, I'm going to just show you so that you can see how they all work in the Junior as well. So, I've put them into my Gemini Junior plates, but I'm just not switching machines. I'm just cutting back in and using my Gemini on here. Now, for this one, you're going to be up, Ben, because I thought I'd do a bit of colouring in. Right? Well, got, yeah, okay. Yeah, so, so you, we, you're all good with your comments. Now, let's have a little look. Yeah, so, well, what... 
I didn't mean to do all this in one go, guys. What I was going to do is show you, if, have a look, see if we needed to emboss it. And if we were embossing it, pokey tool, pokey tool, pokey tool. Where would you be if you were a pokey tool? You'd be right here, Ben. This is the second one I've had out today. Let's see if I can go through like half a dozen by the time we get the end of the show. <laughs> they must hate cleaning up after me, especially when I get panicked and I'm like, I can't find this, I can't find that. And they're like, yep, right in front of you, sorry, you've just had it. So, uh, right, oh, so can you see this here, right? So I should have... Let's have a little look. If you ever do this, this is why I was wondering, should I have um, used this, Ben? Let's just see if we can get it back into place and send it through again. Yes, we could. Uh, I should have done this and I should have sent it through yeah. and, add it and done the embossing as well. So because they're really intricate dies, yes. right? So some of these in particular are more intricate than others. Because this was a really intricate die, we want a beautifully deep die cut and we don't want to have to be sitting doing what I'm doing here, Ben, and popping a few bits out. I so the moral of the story is tape your dies in place, right? And then send them through and do a secondary run pass through and do an emboss. But again, right? you'll have more time to do this at home. That's, uh, that is a very good point. You won't be under the pressure of TV and time constraints. Thank you so much for not just taking the mickey out of me, Ben. No, I would never actually, do that to you, Sarah. And actually help me out there. Really appreciate that. You are more than welcome. Love I've you I've got lots. your back, buddy. You've got me back. He's yeah. got me back. Got your back. Thinks I look like uh, rubbish today, but he's got me back <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Love you too. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> is that what you do, that thing? There you go. <laughs> this, right. Oh, I'm never going to live that one down, am I? You're not, no. I can't believe you said that. I can't believe you haven't had more stick actually for it off our lovely crowd. Or maybe you have, and you're just choosing not to read them comments. Well, out, I've, had, I've, I've had a few a few comments come through <laughs> uh, on that regard. Um, a lot of people oh, commenting. On, bed? Right, go on, I'm going to start colouring your uh, A lot of people just commenting on, on how hi hyper you are today, which I think is brilliant. Maybe Baroness sorry, Agro says, yes. no, no wonder Craig and Ben have the giggly fits. Uh, Sarah is a bad influence, lol. Um, and, and, and this is the thing you see when Sarah's in the boss is in uh, we can we can muck about you know because if Sarah's up for a, a, a bit of fun then it, it, it's all fine um, it's oh, and, and always all fine isn't Sarah always up for a bit of fun come well, on well, guys yeah, well, yeah, it's very I mean, serious business this crafting here oh yeah I mean, come on, and how many, times, how many times on this channel have you seen a show where we are, right, today we are going to be crafting, we're going to be very serious, there's going to be no fun and entertainment. I mean, come on, that's what we're here for. Uh, and lots of people, <laughs> can you even be a bit... Why, why did you put your push voice on? Well, no, as a sort of, you know, my, sort of my boring <laughs> voice. Push. Welcome to Crafters TV. It's very serious, no fun. Um, a <laughs> lot of people. Oh, by the way, I think I'm uh, perfecting my northern accent, having been up here for a few oh, weeks. Oh, good. Now well, you can lose that posh twang. Uh, I'll lose the posh twang. Talk, we don't like people talking too posh up here. I got told off by a woman in the pub yesterday. I went to Pierce Bridge. Um, yeah, oh, I've been to quite, a few pubs around here, there, and she was she was chatting about. Um, I did go over the bridge. I did see the Roman fort. Yep, yeah, saw it all. Um, we, chatting about that place at the road that you guys call Barney. Barney. Yeah, yep. and I call it Barney. That's where I got married, you know. Hey, Barney? Yeah, Barney. Norway, man. <laughs> Love it, Ben. I'm so uh, proud of you. Thank you. And she told me off this woman because I, I was like, oh, Barnard Castle. And she was like, no, it's not called Bar I can't do it. She, was like, she said, it's not called Barnard. She's Barnard. Barnard. And I was like, oh, well, I'm, I'm from down south. I'm a bit posh. That's so Barnard. Yeah. And she said, I don't care where you're from. That's Yorkshire. <laughs> she wasn't from Yorkshire. She was from up here. Uh, she, she basically said, I don't care where you're from. It's Barnard. So I've now, I have learned that. Barnard, isn't it? Barnard, Barnard Castle. Barnard Castle. Barnard Castle. Not, it's Barney. It's just Barney. Why, well, yeah, I man, it's just Barney Lake. What are you doing? <laughs> a divanar? <laughs> uh, and you, you sound so good if you lived about 40 miles north of here. Right? <laughs> but if you're going down the pub saying that in the local village, the villagers are absolutely lance you. <laughs> yeah, just going to warn you, right? You're going to have to work on that a bit more. Can I just say as well, and this is, this is heartfelt, what I love about it up here, like, I, I think sort of from where I'm from, where I'm from, uh, people not always happy to kind of engage in conversation. Up here, everybody wants to chat. I had a chat the other day. I, uh, the DHL guy was delivering something to our neighbours, so I, being the, the nice neighbourly guy, took the, the package so that you know you didn't have to write one of those notes and take it away. And he literally stood and chatted to me for about 20 minutes. Everybody wants to talk up here. Everybody wants to chat. You're everyone's you see? best mate. You thought it was just me. Now I know. <laughs> now I see. Now you get it. Now, now he gets it. Exactly. So seri seriously, it's a very, very friendly place. And it's been very sunny as well. If you notice, since I moved up here, I brought the sun from the south. Loads of, loads, mm. loads of lovely weather. Anyway, um, sorry. 
Are you impressed, by the way, with me? Can you see I've done the blending on the tree? Yes. And also, if I want to put a little bit of blending down the... Um, let's have a little look. If I want to go down the side of these, just to give it a bit of shading down here... You've got a little squirrel running up there. We've well. got a little squirrel on the tree. Yeah. We've got a little bit of a fox at the side. I've still done all of my shading on here. So you just put the shading down the left. Beautiful. Blend it out to the middle one. And then we can go and blend it right out to the lightest one as well. So even though... I'm just using, um, this is not really on, even onto specialist alcohol pen cardstock now, Ben. I'm just, I'm just doing it straight into a little bit of our stamping card, but I'm still getting that lovely blend on there. We have got the um, tri-colours on the show as well, with the basics, oh. neutrals, meadows and um, outdoors. Buy three, get one free. Now, what I, what I didn't want to do is I didn't want to spend ages and do all three of them, Ben. No. I've already got the one where I've done all three, okay. right? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make this now into my shaker card. What I have done, right, is I've gone round and I've done the first layer of double-sided foam tape on here. Okay. So I'm going to lift this first layer of foam tape off. However, I want this to be an awesome shaker card, not just a that's pretty good shaker card. Oh, yeah. So if that's you and you want your shaker cards to be awesome and not just pretty good, yes. then what you're going to do is you're going to do exactly what I'm going to show you now. You're going to do a better job of taking off your back and on your things when you're live on air. And then you're going to double layer your foam tape to get a really, really deep... Um, deep space to put all oh, of your so shakers in. Oh, you get in. more shake there. Yeah, you can get a bit more shake That's going what you on want, with this. Isn't it? Right? So, go on, you're up again. I'm up again. Um, <laughs> love it. Uh, lots of people have been inspired by the concept cards. I must just say that lots of people say, uh, oh, I wasn't quite sure, but now I've seen the concept cards, I totally get this. I'm definitely getting this collection because I've seen how versatile they are. Um, and, and that, again, is the whole point. We'd love to show you the uh, finished samples. We'd love to show you the concepts. So then it sort of sticks in your mind and you go, yes, I need to have these. Um, these card samples are fabs, says Kathy. Um, also, Ka uh, Karen is saying, um, I wish they had the concept suites posted somewhere online. Do you know, that's a good idea. Do we Isn't not do that? that? A good idea. Do you, you would think we would have thought of that before now, wouldn't you? Yeah. I'll find out if we have thought of that before now. Okay. The lovely people who were on from Team Social having a little look. Will you just ask the rest of the social team if we do that anyway, guys? And if they do, tell us where it is. Yeah. Uh, and if not, tell them Sarah said we should do that because that's a really good idea. Well, thank you, Karen. Um, Colleen and um, Susie are uh, social superstars this afternoon, so thank you for that. Um, Linda just saying hi. I had to get the two dies that I didn't get on HSN. Uh, Elaine saying, yes, I did it. What a surprise. Um, oh, what a surprise. Half price shipping. Um, and uh, also, oh, they're not, says Colin. That's on the buy the show later on, isn't it? Uh, the sparkle pens tonight on um, Colour Me Happy is the half price shipping, but you can have a look ahead for that. Um, yes, we haven't got the concept suite posted but we're going to see if we can sort that out i've just had a message to say we're going to see if we can do that so there you go thank you karen great idea brilliant what a brilliant idea. see guys we're always listening we're always listening this is where 10 people shout and say i've asked that five times Sarah, and you've never heard us uh, so, look at this by the way this is that. amazing thanks ben i really like that thanks ben just with the added double layer of foam was it it's, it's, it honestly it makes all the difference mm. to that. And notice what I've done is Ooh. I've gone with blue shakers on the blue background so that it's not like, yay, look at me, I'm really jumping out. It's like subtle. So we took the Wonderland out and then we've added it back in with the kind of starry sky background on there. Yeah, liking that. So there I you am. go. That is like basic shaker carding with a few extra tips thrown in. That's a, unbelievable. That's my favorite of the show so far. How cool is that? How amazing is that? Listen, what's happened here, right, is we've seen two amazing demos already from Sarah. You've seen uh, the finished samples. You've seen the concept suite. And now everyone's going, got to have this. We are a third of the stock gone. Uh, more people tuning in, as you realise now. More people getting up, uh, joining in for us here on this Friday. You need to be in on this because it is now flying. Let's give you an opportunity to check out those baskets. We never want you to miss a moment of the action. So, a uh, couple of minutes here. Get those baskets checked out. Make sure you get those glossy highlights in there as well. They need to be in your basket. Get this collection if you've already got a few of them. Get the multi-buy of the two CTV exclusives. And we will be back with you in just a couple more minutes with more inspiration. had to make some changes to our shipping charges and we want to keep you informed. 
With continued pressure on domestic shipments around mainland US, we've had to temporarily increase the cost of our regular 6 to 10 working day standard shipping service from $9.99 to $12.95 and our free shipping threshold from $100 to $125. We also have some really great news to tell you. We've introduced a brand new shipping service called Express Delivery. This is a fully tracked door-to-door -door service which takes three to seven working days and costs $19.95. This option means you'll get your crafty goodies in your hands sooner, meaning less waiting and more crafting. We're also upgrading delivery services for our Gold and Platinum Club Inspire members who will now receive priority delivery on all of their orders. And if that wasn't enough, we've upgraded these orders to our new Express three to seven day service. Your patience and understanding throughout this very busy time has been amazing. So we'd just like to say a huge thank you and we look forward to chatting to you again very soon. Welcome to Club Inspire, the crafters companion community where you can feed your crafty obsession. Join our fantastic loyalty club today and receive 20% of your first order. We'll also give you 250 points to help get you started. Other benefits of joining Club Inspire include exclusive special offers and discounts for Club Inspire members only, exclusive sneak peek previews of brand new product launches, and of course the Club Inspire community group on Facebook where you can access exclusive content such as downloads, offers and inspiration and of course you can chat and share your makes with other members. You'll receive one point for every pound, dollar or euro you spend and the more points you receive, the more benefits you'll unlock. So what are you waiting for? Sign up, join the club and start rewarding yourself today. Lots of you checking out baskets. This is a busy, busy launch and I am not surprised. I think a lot of you were watching on Wake Up Call earlier on, just kind of getting the idea of the concept of the triptych dies. Uh, and actually, a lot of you checked out during that show. This show now, we are over a third of the stock gone. You need to be in it to win it, uh, whether you're going for the full collection or not. Um, interesting question earlier on as well from um, one of our viewers who was asking about the, um, the Mini. Would these go through the Mini? Yes, uh, they will. And that is one of the reasons why we brought to you uh, this mini collection again which I just think is absolutely brilliant such a great machine uh, you will know that um, I have the uh, machine the size up from this the MIDI but I love the manual machines if you're someone perhaps who's already got an electronic machine uh, you're wanting something that's more portable uh, you know you want something that's quick and speedy this is absolutely perfect for that and of course um, you've got that manual handle that there's no electricity involved with this but you've still got the precision uh, you still got the pressure that you would expect with our Gemini machines and um, within this really really, really portable uh, machine. What we're going to do with this bundle as well is we're going to give you um, three more of your plastic folders and your purple plastic shim, of course, too, because if you are like me and you get a little bit confused or if you get confused very easily, this is simplicity at the heart of it. You just need your plastic folder for your dies uh, and then you've got your purple shim to pop through with your embossing folders. It's so, so super simple. And what I love about this deal particularly as well, <laughs> oh, sorry, my bad, my bad. Wall and then it looks like it's all full and looks even nicer. <laughs> yes! I was singing. Da, 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 da. You get. Look at that bag now! Yeah, I mean, you get. What is in that what bag? What I'm talking about? Two balls of wool! What is in there? Just um, for, for reference purpose, uh, you do get a free bag. You do not get uh, two balls of wool in it. Uh, but. <laughs> The bag! What is, what is she on today? Uh, the bag worth uh, $12.99 uh, or $16.95. That one is yours for free. And you know what? And I know what you're thinking to yourself. Ben, the way I look at this, every time I see this machine, I think of your tagline. And I know, if you've not heard it before, the best way... Oh, it's amazing, Ben. It's amazing. What is this? 
What is it? What it's is an it? amazing tagline that every time I see that machine, all I can think of is this tagline. Yeah, I'm surprised that you've not put it on the box yet. We should have done. We should, it's so amazing. We should have written it on the box. T t tell them all about what it is. Do you ever get the feeling that someone's taking the mickey out of you? No, I do. Do you ever get the feeling the, the boss is I'm just is trying like, to join in with the conversation. My tagline for this machine, <clears throat> we just need to flash this up. Simplicity without electricity. Oh, That's a great yes, tagline. Stop it. stop it, I love it. It's a great tagline. Get in there, tell Leanne's team. Tell them we need to redesign all the packaging. Yeah, we do. Needs redesigning, that's we, amazing. We could, Give we them could, a pay rise. We could have on the box, Give right? Give them you a know, pay rise, that is unreal. No, you, no, you, no, you know, like if someone like endorses a, a product, you could have, you know, TV's Ben Mosby says, and put it on there. <laughs> this is simplicity without electricity. You could have it on the. You could just get a load of stickers made up. You don't even need to redesign the box. You could just get some stickers and just whack the stickers on there. You know. Right. Any no? Yep. Should I go and see Leanne now? Or? Yeah, yeah. You go and have a word with her. All right. Well, uh, I'll leave you. I'll, if you carry on with your next demonstration, I'll just go and have a quick, a quick yep, chat. Yep. Four o'clock on a Friday. She'd be dying to hear from you. Yep. <laughs> right. Well, I'll just you. I'll be back. Well, you go, and, you go and do that. I'll show everyone the concept suite because uh, you guys loved the concept suite. And I, do you know, didn't I say this, right? So the thing with them triptych dies, right? It's, it's everything. So if you miss the start of the show, it's basically a creator card. But what we've done is we've taken the creator card down and split it into three, which means that you've got more versatility. It'll work over more spaces. And the dies themselves are nice and thin so that they will actually fit onto like a slimline card if you want to. So way more versatility. This is our big creator card launch for this summer. I think you guys will love it when you get it home, okay? So I'm going to run you through the concept suite. Just if you're coming back to this point in the show to watch this, this is the bit that you need. I'll take my time and explain it all, okay? So here we go. Let's try and start with some of the simpler ones, right? Oh, I did, uh, I did. I don't Do you need me to jump in? No, I'm just thinking they're all, they're all really... Go on, you can have a second and then okay. I'm going to start. Okay. Okay. Um, Lots of you, by, by the way, saying you're now buying. Um, Khaki Blue is saying, oh, uh, that one may trigger my credit card. That was the last card that we saw. Loving the die, says Terry. Wow, says Rhonda, I love. Beautiful card, Sarah. I can't wait for these to arrive, says Leslie. Um, and Sam just saying, I'm making brownies ready for watching Sarah on Strictly. Yes, Strictly brownies, I love it. Strictly come baking. Uh, it, it would um, also be great, says Jane, if you had a gallery with samples of all of the gorgeous cards that your teams make. I'm loving all these suggestions. Uh, and Mary oh, we do says, have that, we do have that. Huh? Yeah, we do have that. A full on gallery? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And go on Pinterest, you can look them up on Pinterest, you can see them in the Facebook groups. Yeah, 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 we've got all uh, of that sort of. And Marianne just saying, uh, Sarah is the original super mam. We used to have a Super Gran on TV. I remember Super Gran years ago, and now we have our very own Super Mam. So there you are. Oh, kind words for you tears. guys, Super you're so Mam. good to me. Super Mam. Have you got your um, concept suite sorted out now? Yes, I have indeed. You want okay. to see? Right. Yes, please. So guys, really simple. You could just put it onto like a bat, you know, like them bendy window things. Oh, like, like the, um, yeah, I know what you mean. The screens, you yeah, know, the screens. screens. Mm. You could put it onto a basic screen, right? You could also be doing it where you put it onto like a stepper card. So on the front of a step like this, yeah, like that. I like and that. then you see all this bit here. All we've done is we've cut this off and added the pieces that we've cut off into the front. Yes. Uh, you could have a side fold piece, yeah, a lovely side fold piece like this. You could be doing it. Now, this is one with another design cut in behind the back. So can you see the bird? You've got the bird behind and then the bird again. So they cut once and then moved, cut a second time. Ben's like staring at the screen. They can't make that one out of my own little mind. It'll see, come there's to the it. other bird in the background. Uh, oh, yes. Oh, Hang on, hold it there, the Charlotte. Depth. I'm just coming closer. He's having a oh, I can oh, see it now. Now he's got it. Now I was he's too got far it. away. How many of you are watching it on your... Look at our Ben here. Look at I this. can see. Yeah, you can see. I, can, I, can, I have to come up close. No, I haven't no, got glasses. your glasses with your old man. No, I've got my contacts here, but not my glasses. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. No, no, good. Right. Right. Now, diorama. What I love about these as well is if you want to take them next level, so say this has got a Victorian theme with that horse yeah. and cart in. You didn't want the horse and cart in. You just come along with your little snips and snip off here and snip off there and it takes the horse and cart out. See what we're doing there? Nice mm -hmm. and simple, nice and simple. Now, steppers. 
Step is a, one of my favourite all-time cards to make, Ben, with, um, with the creator cards in. And I just think this one here, just because it's triptych, you can use all the same techniques as what you've done with the creator cards. So whether that's your steppers, whether that is things like your easel cards, I think they look absolutely fabulous when you cut into two layers mm. of easels going through. Uh, there's another card that's like that. That's one of my favourite ones. Yeah, here we go. Uh, is that my easel card again? That's the easel. Right. Here we go. You know the the step fold. So three ways. So it's like an easel card. Yeah. But it's like a tent with a base on the bottom. Love them ones. I think they're super clever. Really love them ones there, right? Now, next one that I'm going to do for you as a demo was this style here. What well, is this style? I'm going to be doing this one next. So that is like double gatefold meets in the middle, Ben, but you've got that design coming into the front. Then if you want to do pop-out cards, here is a pop-out. Now look at the difference here, right? Pop out with one cut in the middle, yep. right? Larger pop out with three cuts in the middle, right? I'll get our lovely Charlotte to show you both of those together so you can see the difference. So three cuts in the middle there. Yeah. You've just got one, one cut in the, the fold, middle and yeah. two at the side there. Totally different look, mm. same sort of concept, right? Uh, I mean, that's just a nice simple card, but then on the inside look, it's one of them ones, you know where it's got a, a bigger back than yeah, it has yeah. a front, right? That's fab. And then what you can do is if you make those, if you make one of them, uh, let me open my bird out. So if you made five of those and stuck them all back to back, you would get this sort of card here. And this is when, because they all play nice together, guys. Not being funny, this is why you need all six of these. So that you can make these sort of books and kind of tell a story. Yeah. Look at that. You could oh, you could tell like a Christmas story, the scene, all of this stuff, right? If you just want to do matte and layer up your panels, looks fabulous matting and layering the panels. You want to do them into the lid of a box, got the lid of a box. We've got our different shape boxes. I'm going to be doing this one as well That's for really you. Cute. We're only just halfway into the show, guys. I've got loads more to go. Uh, or, oh, yes. Six sided hexagon box looking amazing. Yes, the resistance there. Yes, that's the one there, right there. Right, I'm going to get ready for the next demo, Ben. Uh, listen, we are so busy right now. 40% of the stock has gone. We are one hour into the show. I don't know where that hour's gone, by the way. It's absolutely flown by. Hopefully, you guys are having as much fun as we are. I tell you what, I know loads of you are checking out your baskets. Do not miss out on these. You have seen just how uh, versatile they are. Uh, lots of you telling me that you're grabbing these as well now, uh, that you're checking out your baskets. Charlotte just saying, I've got the extra set of triptych dies uh, waiting on uh, ones ordered from HSN. I can't wait to play with them. Um, Charlotte saying, um, yeah, sorry, I just read you a shot, haven't I? Uh, Elizabeth's just saying, oh, thank you. I uh, love the tagline, Ben. You are welcome. Um, Aisha's saying, Ben is pushing it. So do we want Ben's pick on every machine box? I mean, I, th I can see them. I could see them selling even more quickly than they do already with my with my mug on the front of them. Uh, great tagline, indeed, Ben. You are finally earning your title as official part timer. Says Gilmore. Thank you. Well, not now. Four days a week, every week. Oh, you'll be sick of the sight of me. Honestly, you will. Um, just to very quickly show you again uh, with this collection, uh, the two that if you did shop on HSN, uh, there's two which you won't have got. And as um, as much as the um, main collection is flying out of the door, a lot of you are going for the multi buy as well. A lot of you have already seen these on HSN. So. Uh, you've got your um, beautiful, charming church. So that's the one that is the CTV exclusive, which a lot of you are going for individually. And then also, by the way, a half the stock of that individually has oh, gone. Oh, yeah, I see what's happening. Yeah. Yep, everyone's buying the ones you didn't get on HSN. Oh, yes. And so that will mean then also you are going for uh, the village as well. The quaint village, uh, 11.99 or 13.56. And a lot of you go for it. So what you're doing, Two for 26 or two for 30, those are the two which are flying out on that multi-buy. Uh, but then on top of that, of course, you're gonna get all of the other four that you've already seen within this collection. Uh, that beautiful, magical woodland. You're gonna get uh, the fairies as well. <laughs> and <laughs> so I'm just laughing at Zara, right? Sorry, here's, here's the thing. Well, do you, remember, you, you guys have seen my big water bottle that I, that I normally have. I haven't brought it in today. And when I brought it in, everybody took the mickey out of me saying, like, why do you need such a big water bottle? That looks ridiculous. Stupid looking water bottle. Why have you got that? Uh, hang on a second. Hang on a second. All of a sudden, someone else has got exactly the same water bottle in a different colour. It's like, oh, that's such a cool water bottle. Oh, I love your water bottle. It's really great. Can I just say, Ben, some might think, oh, one o'clock. You're not, not drunk enough. Time. 
She's behind time. Yeah. No, 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 no. This is my second bottle of the day, guys. <laughs> second <laughs> bottle of the day. <laughs> Boom. Yes, having it today on with the water. <laughs> How on earth you managed to drink uh, one and a half of those, I've, I've no idea. Uh. <laughs> yeah, you'll know about it because if Ben has to talk for like three <laughs> minutes in a while, <laughs> you'll know why. <laughs> Just make sure you turn your mic off, for goodness sake. Uh, right, we've uh, also in this collection, my absolute favourite, I said it earlier, I'll say it again, I've loved this theme that you've seen run through um, a lot of the uh, products that we've brought you. Um, the over the rooftops I think is great and with this one you do get that extra die, Father Christmas there, uh, so you can place him uh, in front, behind, wherever you want um, on your triptych design. And then lastly, uh, you've got that more religious theme with the O holy night all of those launching today should be over 93 pounds or 107 dollars if you're a platinum member that price is ridiculous 58 pounds 39 or 67 dollars and 16 cents uh, lots of chat as well about the back in stock item that we have and i think as many of you who are buying this collection or going for the multi-buy are also going hang on a minute the glossy highlights are back in stock i'm having those in my basket as well we've got people multi-ordering these um and i know uh, sarah's got a bottle in her hand right now for people who may have missed out on these initially and i, I reckon there might be a few because they were in and out so quickly why yeah, it was like, so it was many like over a weekend these? i think it, it was a day or a couple of days yeah so th what this gives you is that glass effect over top of something so if you ever want something to look like it's been enameled or you know resin you know resin crafting is massive ben this is like the cheats way okay. to do that we like that right um, i've never been able to get the hang of resin love the idea love the effect never got it right once when i had like a, a full on one of the top resin teachers in the world sitting over me teaching me it i was in mm. a studio it's the only time i've ever got it right right but watch this so if we wanted to resin up just the trees in the background right all we do is you just come straight over top of them can you see it's like a big glassy bubble so you can apply this to anything so what a lot of people do ben yeah is that like i'm using it over the over the tree area here but you might want to just put like three little spots of it in a corner or something now you must leave it to dry right so what we'll do is i'll put this on now and then we'll leave it now maybe it's by the end of the show it might have dried off a little bit so that you can kind of see it but if you leave it overnight the whole thing will go glassy overnight and that's what i honestly the effect is absolutely incredible now what i would say is a, a bottle will last you a long time so on one hand, I would say only get one. You only need one bottle. It's going to last you for ages. However, right? It's a big however with that one. <laughs> however. Right? Uh, how long ago was it since we launched it? A few months. Yeah. That's how long it takes us when we sell out to get the next batch in, right? So if you're really loving it and you're like going to going to glassify up a load of effects on your Christmas yes. cards or something or whatever. For the sake of like $5.99 or $6.99 dollars, don't get caught short. Just order yourself a couple of bottles. Like a porky tool, Ben, you want one in every craft bag, right? Absolutely right. So the sort of thing that you, for that sort of price, it won't, won't come in wrong, right? Nice. And you'll see there, when we leave that to dry, and I'll show you it at the end of the show, you'll be like, oh yes, I like what she's done on them trees. But you do need to leave it. You can see the glass coming to effect a little bit Oh, there. already a little bit, uh-huh. Yeah, but it's once it's dry, it's gonna look absolutely amazing. Should I, should I do the little deer down here and then, right, so I'll do the deer, just so that you can see it on a different colour as well to the green. You see how I'm just being quite gentle, I'm almost barely putting any on Ben. I mean, we've squeezed the tiniest amount out here. Yeah. But you can see there that deer. So it'll go back to the deep brown that it is, but it'll have the glass effect on it when it's finished. Just just like resin. Honestly, I keep coming back to that resin thing, but it's just like resin. Looks immense. It's great though, isn't it? We can achieve these effects in a, in a nice, easy way. Uh, and we'll have a look at that as well, um, hopefully towards the end of the show, just to see that effect coming to the fore. And as Sarah said, you know, if you've already bought um, a bottle of this, if you've managed to get a, a, your hands on a couple of bottles when we originally launched this, uh, buy it again, because no doubt you're already enjoying using it. So what's the point in not getting more now? Because you'll run out and then chances are you'll come back to get some and we won't have it in stock again so that stock up now get a couple three more bottles so you've got them there in your craft room uh, and you're ready to go uh, when you need that next bottle four pound 79 or five dollars and 56 cents if you are a platinum member uh, lots of love coming in for this show um our colleen just saying as well i love the glossy highlights too yeah it seems to me that loads of you love those 
Loads of you loving this main collection as well. So many comments coming through. Uh, we are over 40%. We're heading towards 45% of the stock gone here. Lots of chat. Carol Ann just saying these are multi-versatile uh, dies, definitely. Uh, for Holidays Design saying, I love the black and white samples. Uh, you can really see all the possibilities. That's that concept suite. Um, we need a craft log on the box, please, says Mary Pat. Uh, no doubt you'll see one very, very soon with these. So many ideas running through my head, says Terry Gibson. Um, and Gilmore on YouTube just saying, I always love the banter between Sarah and Ben. Uh, long time i can't believe in retrospect i let you have that long off i mean how long does it take to move house last time i did it in a day yeah but but i we had to we went from a long we went from a long way away didn't we, we had to come along all right so long way. that's a five hour drive so is it not like a day in five hours then yeah but then i have to do all of the you know being that like, i have to do all the lifting and <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing for <laughs> Oh, I bet that's been Ooh. interesting to watch. Ben has to do the raw, the raw, so yeah, whatever. I have to do all of that, and then I had loads of DIY to do as well. And for those of you who follow my uh, Facebook page, you'll have seen that. Charlotte! For those of you who've seen my Facebook page, you'll know I did a little video showing you my DIY skills. I hung up all of the curtain poles uh, around oh, my house. Well done. Oh, you did some DIY. I did some DIY, man. and I did it. I, I hung them up. I did it by eye. Uh, so they are a little bit crooked, but they haven't fallen out the wall yet, which is always uh, a bonus as far as yeah, I'm concerned. Yeah, I did the ones in our last house, and, and most of them were out within a year. So, yeah, I really, really hope you have. You, you did use plugs, didn't you? You did I, use plugs. I did use uh, plugs and I had to get a different plugs. drill to the one I had because the drill that I had was a bit crummy. So I got this big powerful <laughs> glasses on. You better not it. have had a pneumatic drill just for putting a couple of curtains. It wasn't a pneumatic <laughs> drill. <laughs> it was just like a, it was a hammer drill. A hammer drill is what it's called. Okay guys, moving swiftly on. Anyone's got any requests uh, or want DIY advice from Ben, just drop them in the comments. I'm your man. Back to them. <laughs> ben the Builder. Ben the can Builder. You can you fix it? No, we can't. <laughs> no, we can't. Uh, anyway, back to right. the triptych dies. What else have you got to show us, Sarah? Well, you know it's good. You know it's a big show when we end up off on one like this, right? <laughs> Do you know what? We'll be in so much trouble off everybody, Ben. If we get to the end of the show and everything's sold out, they say, well, you didn't tell us it was going to sell out because you no. were too silly. We'll <laughs> yeah. get in bother. <sighs> right. <laughs> I had a bit too much. Well, it was me crossing my legs because I've had a bit too much juice. Do you want to? I can. Do you want to? You okay? I'm a professional. Professional. You get through a two-hour show without a loo break? Can you? Oh, absolutely. Well, we'll find out because there's We will find out in a minute. Right. So come on. Can you remember what card I said? We're going to show you the double four-back gatefold, right? Just like that, Ben. That yeah. That. Go on. Give us the action. Is that one? Is that one of new dances you've learned? <laughs> do you know that'd be good? Who needs big fish, little fish, cardboard box when you could do the double double fold and game fold? It's not that. That's no? quite funny though. Oh. I was quite impressed with that. Thank you. Right guys, so double fold back gate fold. I'm doing it on a fa <laughs> What was that? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> There's a pig in it somewhere. <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> Unbelievable. What was that? I have no idea. Where's that pig gone? <laughs> Just, sorry, oh, sir. Don't, ben, don't do stuff like that because because then they'll cut then they'll cut these things out and put them in blooper reels and I haven't got my eyelashes and my dress on. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be looking like this and you'll be saying she's looking like this. Can I just say as well? Sorry, this is going off the point. Uh, we get a little staff. Do you ever get the little the little staff electronic letter that comes round? You know, with like the, this is what's happened this month. And there's I, all... I write it. Huh? I, I write it. All it's, right, it's, so you write it. From Sarah. Ah, uh, that that one. You're on the company. I write the note at the yeah. top. It yeah. says it's yeah. all up to date. Email of what's going on in the company. Okay, this month. well, well, I'll, I'll say this to you then. What I I'm always on the bloopers reel, right? Because you always do like a little. Here's the funny blooper stuff that's okay, gone wrong. You only have, like it's only a couple of your Ben, so it's quite high likelihood you. No, would be no, on no. The Let me finish reel. the sentence though. But then the stuff that's like that I'm doing, it's not a blooper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, why is this in the bloopers reel? I just reel? think you're really funny. <laughs> so, so, this was me, this me being real. Just why? the Ben is funny real. Uh, yeah, but anyway, I just thought I'd put that out. Okay, well, thank you. Um, carry on. <laughs> bloopers so, guys. Reel. Double fold back gatefold <laughs> card 
on a stop laughing at me on a five by seven base because the dies work really really well so if you look here right the dies are designed to work on a lovely five by seven base now they all tell a story if we put them back in the right order you'll see the story right i obviously didn't put these back last time i did the last demo with oh, yeah. these right so can you see and it was me i can't even blame craig there we go so you've got bird in the middle with this one you can see the branches come through the bird and a fairy at either side, right? So what I'm going to do, Ben, is I'm going to do a 5x7, see how well they fit onto that lovely 5x7, but then we need the gatefold to cut around it. So that's 5x7. Then I've done two pieces of card that are 75 five with a score line at half an inch and a score line in the middle. Okay. Right? Got it? Mm -hmm. Because what these are going to do is they are going to at um, attach round the side of the card like that. Can we see? Yep, happy with that? Mm -hmm. Then we're going to do exactly the same here. Fold that one round there. That is then going to attach onto this side of the card as well. And that gives you a perfect size four back gatefold. Don't overcomplicate it for yourself and try and do it all out of one sheet, guys. Just don't bother, right? Seven by five, right? Seven and a half by five. Score line at halfway and a score line at, at half an inch. So half an inch here, three and a half inches in from this side here. Four inches if you're coming from that way. You need two of them exactly the same, okay? So I'm going to start with this base one, Ben, and we're going to put the three dies on here. Let me show you a, a, another way that you could do this if you wanted, right? So if you want to use your magnetic, what you can do is, is you can take these and you can go right in the middle. So I'm using up that centre line right in the middle, one to the left, one to the right, so that we're using the magnetic to hold it all in place. If you do that, you absolutely categorically must put your other plate underneath, mm -hmm. right? I'm actually going to bring these down onto that next line here, and I'm going to use the grid. Can you see how you just use it, Ben, to oh, position to line everything it. perfectly? Yes. Yep, once you're in, that must go there. So I'm looking for that centre line, in fact, if we're going to do it, let's do it perfect. So that is seven inches, three and a half would be our halfway point there. I'm going to pop that so that halfway point lines up with that. They're going to be in the centre, happy with that. And then what you do is you use a little bit of tape bend and you stick the card to the base. Now the reason, guys, that I don't do this usually when we do Crafters TV is because if you tuned in halfway through that demo, you wouldn't be able to see what was underneath. Right? So what I always do is, I, I do it the other way just so that you can see the dies. Right? If that, yeah. all, if that all makes sense. Mm -hmm. So, straight through your machine. Let's do an emboss while we're on with this one. So I'll get my embossing mat back out because it's, it's actually, I'm always rushing through these demos guys, but if you take your time, it's far better to do them. Take your time and get them absolutely spot on and do your little bits of embossing in there too. So take these out of here. Do, 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 do. Got all those out. Yep, you're back in there. Happy with that. What I should have done is taped the top and the bottom, and then it'll be even more perfect. Top mm -hmm. and the bottom, and then we can put our magnet. Oh no, I'm not going to put. I'm not going to put this on because what I need to do is I've taped it to the magnetic. I need to take my magnetic out. Oh, okay. Right. So I could do this. Watch. Do do do. Out. 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 Take me magnetic out. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm not oh, going to risk it, no. right? I'm not going to risk it because I don't want to mess up my demo live on TV and everything, right? Just for the sake of a little bit of embossing when we've got that much pressure, it's pretty much embossed anyway. But you can see that if you wanted an extra deep emboss, yeah. hold it in place with your tape, not onto the magnetic mat, and then you can send that through and you can set it through and emboss it a second time. Fab. Right? So there we go. Once we're to this stage, Ben, can you remember that technique I showed you right at the beginning? Well, those of you who were here right at the beginning will have seen. If you've just joined us partway through, we did this card. Let me just show you it again, where I showed everyone how to do, um, have, how to get the glow around the outside. Oh, uh, yes. Uh -huh. Yep. So if you want the glow around the outside, let me just take these one at a time. So my little fairy goes on there. Just drop the die back into place. And what you're going to do is you're going to take a little bit of blue and just do the kind of sunburst effect coming off. Yeah. Right? And then a little bit round the sides as well, and right round the bottom too. Right, so there's number one. And then while we're still there, number two, my little birdie, just fits onto there again. And you'll find it'll just drop into place, yeah. lovely. 
and then I'm taking that out again. Just to say, oh. get your hands on those glossy highlights because there's so much chat about those now. Um, I used to just saying I've got three bottles of the glossy highlights. They're a must have for my stash. I like tape pens. Hannah Law saying, love the glossy highlights. Amaze balls. I love that word. Uh, I had to get more today because my eight year old uh, SN uh, Spectrum Noir snob granddaughter has been oh, eyeing my bottle. I like that. Spectrum Noir snob granddaughter. Can I give a big shout? What's your granddaughter called? Let me know. I want to give her a big shout out. Yes, Hannah Law, let us know, please. Um, and when you were popping those on to the, uh, to the, the card earlier on, uh, Crafty Andrew was saying, was Sarah putting the highlights directly onto the acetate? Uh, no, she was no, putting was them onto the little onto bit the of little, card yeah. that went underneath the acetate. If you want, guys, I'll do it again. Yeah. Uh, I'll do a little bit more on it after this card here so you can see a little bit more. Or actually, we could always highlight a little bit of this one as well. Oh, yeah, we? we could, couldn't we? We could highlight a bit of anything we fancy, Ben, to be honest, because you've got the whole bottle there. We can do all sorts. Right. <laughs> Look at how good that looks when oh, you yeah, mask perfect. off. Right, and you get that sunburst coming through. That's what I love about it, right? So, we've done that with those. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take this. So, can you see this one here is going to wrap around the outside like that. And then this one here is going to wrap around the outside doo -doo, like this, right? And then we're going to do another. We're going to bring these in. Yeah. And we're going to put just the fairies on the outside, one at each side, okay? Okay. So leave the bird and do the fairy at the other side. Now, good news, folks. I've already done the two of them. I knew you were going to say there that. There we go. Ever there's prepared. one fairy at the left. Yeah. And then there's one fairy at the right. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you, I've got a couple of different options of what we could do here, right? You might want to lose the branch out. So if we want to lose the branch out, watch this. We literally got, it's got such snippability, these dies. So you're just going in with your little, these little snips are perfect for this, by the way, folks, right? You just want your snippability with your little snips, and then you're going to cut two off there, and now you've got just the fairy, oh, right? Uh -huh. Could do exactly the same here. So coming down, losing this off, just try and follow the line a little bit. Do you know, it's amazing how many terms you use in crafting that are just the same terms you use in dancing, Ben. Didn't realise until today. What, same terms? <laughs> yeah. Follow the same line, follow, the, follow the line, follow yeah. the line. Yeah, yeah. So, right, so we can lose, actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this and I'm going to lose the whole A few branch. people have asked as well, actually, including Susan, w would you be able to use these on your foil press? Oh, yes. Yeah. <gasps> now you're Great talking. Great idea. That now was you're uh, talking. Susan. Right, let's have a little look. Have I got, now, what have I got? I've got my clear sparkle pen. That would look lovely. Uh-huh. Uh, have I got a silver... My, no, but I've got, should our fairies be silver or should we try a gold, see how she looks gold? What have you oh, fancy? Yeah, she looks just Ooh. nice gold Ooh. as well. So I'm just going to give her a bit of a colour in. And, gold uh, and fairy. Oh, I like it, Ben, I like it. <laughs> Is that as much as we're getting? I can't think of the next line. Oh, we better not do it anyway in case we have to pay royalties. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't said that if you change the words. Oh yeah, if you change the words, it's fine. I did. Gold fairy. <laughs> Do you know, they, did, have you seen, have you seen, Ben, my interview about Strictly, where they asked me what song I'd like to dance to? Uh, it's on, it's on Instagram, right? They said, no, what song you... would you like to dance to? Guess what I said? Did you say, what did you say? I said, I would like to dance to Cobra Cabana. Did you actually? Yes. Go on, honestly, go and have a look. I kid you not, right? It's on you. It's on uh, Instagram, and I think we might get it shared across to Facebook if, if we haven't. Sometimes I post them up, and then they share across. Just went up this morning while I was in training. Oh, I'll well, I'll have to look out for that because I do catch a lot of your um, your stuff on Instagram. Oh, that's that's good. Yeah. Clearly, he's not hanging off my every word though, folks. Is what I took from that little thing there. Very busy man. I've been DIYing, DIYing moving, putting curtain poles up and all sorts. Putting yeah, up curtain yeah. poles. And by the I'm, way, Sandra, talking about sorry, talking about them curtain poles. I did not use no more nails. Oh, thing. no. No. <laughs> Someone asked that. No, um, definitely. Uh, well, I'll have, so, so the video uh, has gone up today on your Instagram? Uh, yes, yeah, so it went up on the BBC's Instagram uh, early this week, and I've just shared it across to my Instagram. That's why I'll have to say I don't know if we can share it across to Facebook or not. Oh, OK. But, um, look, I'm sharing a little bit have of a sparkle as well. It's, um, it's hard yes. to keep up because you're on so many things, aren't you? You're, you're here, there and everywhere, and it's hard to keep up with where you are, what you're doing, who you're chatting to, you know, radio, TV, superstar. I'll have a look though. You can just go on Instagram and Facebook and just keep up to date, Ben. It's not that difficult. I will. 
I will. Excellent. Um, got the memo. You got the memo. Uh, got the, yeah, Mary Lee is saying, I've been laughing so hard, uh, I can't type any comments. Uh, too funny, the both of you. Um, and uh, lots of you chatting again about this collection and a lot of you saying you're buying those glossy highlights as well. Uh, people saying they bought once and then came back and got another bottle. So whichever you're going for today, these are flying. That gold fairy's turned out all right, isn't she? She's not too bad, is she not? She's not too bad at all. Not too bad at all, she is. Right, and then look what I'm gonna do, because you can see a little bit of that under there. All I'm gonna do is, well, I'll, I think I'll cut it first, trim it afterwards, right? So watch this, a little bit of cutting on there. Connect on. Once we are connected, yes, now you're talking, and we're just going to come in and then trim this bit off, Ben. Does that all make sense? Yeah, absolutely does. Yeah, as long as everyone can see what I'm doing, I don't need to kind of explain myself, if um, it helps. Aisha just saying, um, great reminder, talking about the magnetic uh, in the... Um, Great reminder, the grid can be used for perfect positioning. That's why I love CC. Constant reminders about the basics that make our lives easier. Cindy's got her order in. Um, Rebecca on YouTube says, Sarah, you look beautiful without eyelashes. Oh. Oh, you mean the stick on one? The yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think she meant without me real eyelashes, don't no. worry. Um, yeah, but I do look better with me stick on eyelashes, don't I? I do, well, I'm sure I do you would like still. the eyelashes. I'm sure you would still look beautiful without eyelashes. Uh, Deborah says, oh my heavens, you two are just too much fun. The funnier you are, the faster you talk. I have to rerun it several <laughs> times to hear what you're saying. Yeah, we should probably should have been aware of that, Ben, shouldn't we? Um, Leslie says, I got one bottle of glossy highlights, then went back and got another one. Um, and Aisha saying, Lord Ben, we're still waiting on the boy band song. When is it coming? It's still there on the back burner, but I actually had a meeting uh, today with our, um, our social, our oh, social media guru. Oh, had a meeting today. Oh, yeah. That's a very formal He bit. always, always comes to me. Um, <laughs> uh, because we had a little meeting. And anyway, um, there might be, there might be a, 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 a song coming soon for something which is coming in October. I've been commissioned to do something. Oh, so, uh, he's been commissioned. He's been commissioned. What do we think he's been commissioned for, guys? Guys. Big money deal it was as well. <laughs> money deal. <laughs> we shook hands. So uh, something's coming your way uh, with the something which is coming your way soon in October. You know well, what it well, is. Well, it's a big month, October, isn't it? It is a big month. It is a big month, it crafters. Is a big, big month because you know what we're talking about. Oh yeah, everybody knows what everybody knows what we're talking about. Actually, there might be some new customers that we've had in the last year that don't know what we're talking about. Ben, are we allowed to talk about what we're talking about, which everyone knows what we're talking about, or not to talk about it? Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Yep. Well, well, I don't we've, know got, we've got about 30 seconds while I finish my matin and layering. All right, so our, um, our birthday is coming. Uh, 16, isn't it? 16 Sweet 16. Years. Sweet 16. Um, I honestly don't know the official dates for it yet, but I can tell you we look forward to our birthday. It's like the biggest event that we do here um, at Crafters TV. Um, it's going to be amazing this year. I, I think I can tell you that um, for, the, for the, only the third time in the year that I've been here, I actually met up with Joe last week. We were together in the same room. <gasps> we, we the did, same room? We never see each other. No. We never see each other. And we were part of a bit of a um, secret photo shoot uh, for everything that is our um, our big birthday coming up. So there's lots to look forward to. Keep listening, there keep is. watching. I've seen the pictures. It's definitely one to look forward to. Oh, yes. Um, October. I don't know the exact date yet, um, but it is going to be amazing. Biggest and best one yet. Biggest and best one yet. Well, they, we're under pressure every year, you know, <laughs> no. for it to be bigger and better than we ever. Are. So, right, here we go. I've just added that little bow onto there, right? And I quite like that with the base on there. And then what I'm going to do, Ben, is I'm going to come in with that glossy highlights and we're going to add in a little bit of the glossy highlight onto our fairy as well. Uh, no word of a lie with this. The, people are buying one, two, three, four, five bottles of this. We've got people going, oh, I bought a couple. I've come back and I bought more because people loving, loving, loving uh, just how brilliant your glossy highlights are and you don't want to miss out. Um, Sarah, Sarah just saying, loving the show. Thank you for putting the smile and giggles uh, my way. Um, we're Gilbert. always good for that, guys, by the way. Anytime you want me and Ben, you're absolutely going to get that. I can guarantee it. That, that is absolutely it. Um, and Skillmore just saying, speaking of October, Sarah, we would love to have you, Ben and Joe on the show at the same time during birthday week. Can you imagine that? Oh, yeah, Can you imagine? I, I don't know if I could, to be honest. That would know, be a lot. I don't know if I could. That would be a lot. I don't know how I feel about that. What? I mean, how would I get a word in edgeways? Well, I was about to you say You were supposed thing. to be the support act, you know. Oh, yeah. For us, us big, big timers. <coughs> no, 
I'm not it. kidding. Like, honestly, we're the important ones. We're the glue, never, aren't we? We do the craft. You, you guys just do the chit chat. We do the chit chat. We hold it all together. I mean, I don't think we just do We're not getting much crafting, there'll be too much chit chat. We don't just do the chit. We hold the thing together, don't we? We make sure it runs to time and, you know, we, we're we more important than just the chit chat. Isn't that what our lovely producer does? <laughs> You just, you just do what they tell Stop you. Stop downplaying my part, Sarah. Anyway, what a just lovely just card you're making. What a life gets to just chit-chat for a living. <laughs> right, here we go. Right, I'm just going to stand it up a little bit. However, don't leave it standing up like that, right? Because you're going to need that glossy highlights to set. So what you want is, you can see the gloss already. I'm going to lie it down. I'm going to let it settle so that I can show you it at the end of the show, just in case that's a winner for our demo of the show. Oh, wow. What an amazing show this has been so far. So much inspiration, so much chat. Do you know what I love most about this show as well is that um, I think so many of you bought earlier and there's a few of you who sat back and watched this show. Um, you've kind of thought to yourself, what is this concept? What is it all about? I, I need to find out more. And now that you've seen these demos, now that you've seen that concept suite, there's so many of you now buying because I can tell you with half an hour left on the show, just over half an hour, we are now at 50% of the stock gone so many of you the light bulbs are sort of going off and you're going ah yes i get this now and actually lots of you now saying to me that you're loving the ideas that sarah has thrown your way but you've now got more ideas for yourself as well you're coming up with other ways that you're going to use these triptych dies which is just brilliant and that's absolutely uh, what we are here for so much excitement so much chat remember get that full collection for 58 pounds 39 or 67 dollars 16 We've got the two exclusive to see TV dies for you as well. We'll recap on all the boards for you in just a few moments time. Uh, but listen, let's give you time now to check out your baskets because I know you don't want to miss the fun. You don't want to miss the demos. So there's two minutes coming up for you here. Whatever it is that you've got in your basket, get to that checkout, get it checked out. And we will be back here for you in two minutes. Welcome to Club Inspire, the crafter's companion community where you can feed your crafty obsession. Join our fantastic loyalty club today and receive 20% of your first order. We'll also give you 250 points to help get you started. Other benefits of joining Club Inspire include exclusive special offers and discounts for Club Inspire members only, exclusive sneak peek previews of brand new product launches, and of course, the Club Inspire community group on Facebook, where you can access exclusive content such as downloads, offers and inspiration. And of course, you can chat and share your makes with other members. You'll receive one point for every pound, dollar or euro you spend. And the more points you receive, the more benefits you'll unlock. So what are you waiting for? Sign up, join the club and start rewarding yourself today. Welcome to Crafters TV. With more than 35 hours of live shows each week, it's your home for all things craft. We shine the spotlight on new and innovative crafting products with live tutorials and demonstrations. Join our family of craft experts where fun happens every day. Quiet. Ah, oh, the neighbors. I'm all out of Zoom. I'm so lost without you. I'm not, I'm not singing. I'm not singing. Lisa, if you email in, don't send a picture of your air fryer. Make sure it's something creative. Get creative and craft along. With our amazing deals, your next craft project is just a click away. Tune in live seven days a week, or you can watch us on Catch Up at crafterscompanion.com, Facebook, or our YouTube channels. You can chat to us, craft along, and meet new friends by joining our online crafting community. You entertain us, you give us a community to talk, you know, in the chat. That wouldn't happen without you guys. It's like, um, Crafters Companion is magical. There's magic here. Joy, there's not a dry eye in the studio here. <laughs> Debbie's welling up, I'm welling up. There's a show for every type of crafter, from first-time dabblers to full-time makers. Crafters TV, create every day. 
So much chat coming in. By the way, well done to those of you who checked out your baskets there. Producer Johnny telling me loads of you took, taking that advice and getting those baskets checked out. Uh, Aisha just saying October is CC birthday month and my birthday uh, and uh, CC anniversary of my first direct purchase. Super excited to celebrate by spending a lot of money on crafty goods. Lol. Uh, and Janelle Brown Bryant on Facebook says, I really don't understand this power that Sarah has on my credit card. Yes, yeah, she has this uh, magical, mystical power. And as we always say, we're the enablers here. If you've come to us going, oh no, tell me to stop, tell me to stop, you have come to the wrong place. And listen, why would you want to stop? Over half of the stock has gone now of the triptych dies. Let's just go back to Sarah here because I think it's really important for you to see the versatility that you've got with these. And actually, um, every time we show you these, you guys are going, oh, I get it now. I understand how versatile these are. Uh, and you are getting these in your basket. So if you're still kind of yet to think to yourself, what can I use this for? And this is a really useful little segment here to have a look at the different types of cards that you can make um, with Sarah. Yes, come on. So, you can start in that. In fact, put that away. Right. Let me start here. For those of you who missed the beginning of the show, you're probably watching thinking, what is this triptych they're banging on about? Where, 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 uh, uh, is this a new concept I've missed, okay? What it is, is we've taken the concept of a creator card, but split it into three panels. So for example, let me just get that card that I did first of all. This is the first thing that I showed everyone how to do. You've basically got the creator card split across three equal panels. Because it's split across three, and if I just get that actual die to show you, so can you see these are the three dies here? They're designed to be like a five by seven creator card, but in three panels. And the versatility of the three panels is going to be everything I'm about to show you in the concept suite. Plus, each one of these is essentially a slimline creator card. For those of you who want to do your Christmas tags that are this shape if you're wanting to do your little mini slimline cards they're perfect so not just for the bigger cards that i'm showing you here but oh, actually for all different cards on there right excuse me running around in me joggers <laughs> if you missed that bit well ben you'll, if you miss that bit you just have to go and watch back and see what's going on <laughs> i'm not about to go down that rabbit hole again and have ben take the mickey out of me again right so no i'm i'm, I'm dressed up because i've been to me dance training guys in case <laughs> i feel like i need to explain now no dress, no eyelashes, no hair wash today. And doesn't Sorry. Sarah look brilliant, everybody? Sorry. I was saying I'm really big smiley t-shirt though. Yeah. Aye, aye, big smile. Yeah. Right, so what you've got is you've got your die split across three now, so it works fantastically well on like a screen card. Or if you want to do something, so because it's a five by seven, Ben, you could just do your basic five by seven cards. Yeah. So it's just a basic five by seven, but what I've done here is put the extra step on the bottom. Really cool. And then out of all of these, you can, you've got great snip ability. Yeah. So you can snip these in and add them onto the front. And the detail you've got in here, like the little squirrel running up the tree, the deer in the background, all of those can be either snipped away or left in, right? Now, you can move past the basics. This one here is the same die twice. So you've got, Ben struggled to spot this. Look, I see it now. In the background, you can see it now, mm. right? Once and then moved along and done another time. Or a nice basic five by seven fold back. Very where cute. you just put it into the fold back. Or that card that we've just done, was a similar take to that. So this one here was a gatefold card, but a gatefold, I always sound posh when I say gatefold, because when I say gatefold, gatefold, nobody understands what I'm saying, gatefold. <laughs> um, I said that on TV in America and the presenter had to ask me four times what I was actually saying, like, you know, gate, gate. She's like, oh, oh gate, a gate. A gate. So gate. now I always say gatefold. Get fault <laughs> on my eight cards. They're, they're yeah. the two words I always pronounce properly, right? Yeah. So there is your double fold back gate fold card. I feel silly now. Stop laughing at his producer, Johnny. In my ear, I can hear you. <laughs> if you're going to laugh at me, turn me off. Then I don't feel so bad. Right, so this is your tent fold, right? So the basic five by seven tent fold. How good's that been with the design behind there as well? Cool. Love that. Now, if you didn't want this to be Christmas, just don't put this in the background. Yeah. Right? It doesn't have to be Christmas. There you go. You didn't want it to be a nighttime view. Just cut Nip. out the stars and the moon. Yeah. And it's a daytime. Little t you know, so, so much versatility. The designers have excelled themselves. We gave them a vision. Our illustrators have taken it to another level, okay? Now, I love, you know I love a good stepper card. Centre step. You've seen me do loads of, of centre step cards, Ben. Centre step, though, with your trip titching. So five by seven, centre step, trip titch in the middle. Love it. Regular easel fold card. 
There's nothing regular about this card though, is there not? That is the church one. By the way, this one was not available on HSN. So the six designs, Ben will walk you through them all. Two of them, HSN didn't select to go on air. So those of you that ordered from HSN, you're missing a couple from your collection, okay? Now, pop-out cards. Love a pop-out. There's your basic pop-out, okay? If you want to double up, what you can do is do a larger pop-out, put all three pops in the middle. Yeah. Love that concept, right? And then also, the one that I really like is, and if I had more time on the show, maybe this one would be a good one to do as a craft along, by the way. What you do is you put a smaller piece in the middle than what's on the back there, Ben. And then if you do five of those and stick them back to back, your five of those back to back is going to look something like this. Right, so you can see there the five back to back. What do you call it? Like you... a star book, did you say? Yeah, so I called it a star book. Mm. Now, when I do a star book, I generally do it as a pop out, so pop these bits forward with a dangling piece, but that's a slightly different take on a star book. Either way, I think it looks absolutely brilliant. I do. It? Looks fabulous, right? So there's your star books. Now, also things like diorama cards. You love the diorama cards. You've got things like your boxes. So if you want to do a box and you've got the cut-ins into the box, if you want to take box making to another level, this is six sides on your box, Ben. Or this one here, little tea light holder, which is what I'm going to demo next for you. Oh, brilliant. Three sides. So if you give me a minute to tidy down, yes. then I'll show you all those designs and whatnot. I'll get ready and we'll make one of those perfect size for a tea light and I'll give you all the dimensions. So go and get your pen and pencil out now so you can write them down. Uh, Brill stuff. So many of you, again, on the comments, loving this show, loving the fun, loving the uh, education, loving the product as well. Uh, must you say, very happy 75th. We've been chatting a lot about our uh, birthday. Alice Gurig on YouTube just saying, speaking of birthdays, today is my 75th. Well, Alice, uh, many happy returns. Yay. Happy birthday from all of us here at Crafters TV. Uh, let me just quickly go through those boards just while Sarah is getting ready, just to show you exactly everything that you're going to get. Chatting about the two uh, sets which you haven't got if you shop with HSN, and these two exclusive to us um, here on CTV. Um, so you've got your Charming Church. So uh, this one uh, exclusive to Crafters TV, as I said, um, if you have already got the uh, previous ones to make to send, you can add this one and this one here, which is your quaint village into your basket. Uh, so uh, 26 pounds or $30 uh, individually, the 14.99 or $16.95. Uh, platinum is 11 pounds 99 or $13.56. And as Sarah has been saying to you, the great thing about these is you can mix and match them if you want to. You, the snippability with these is absolutely immense as well. So whereas you have got some more sort of Christmassy scenes, you've got the ability to snip and manipulate these uh, to make them look year round as well. This is proving really, really popular, your magical woodland. The stags are always a huge winner. Uh, and again, love the fact here that you've got plenty of snip ability, whether you go straight into the card and use them uh, as that kind of creator card effect, whether you want to cut out individual elements and then kind of add even more depth and dimension to your cards, you've got the ability to do that as well. Uh, this one is gorgeous, your um, beautiful fairies. Uh, again, really, really popular individually, but that is another one of the sets which comes within this bundle. This is the one for me, uh, the one with uh, Santa over the rooftops. You get, nearly broke into song then, uh, you get that extra uh, die with um, Father Christmas and all of the reindeer there. But, but as again, Sarah was saying, you don't have to use uh, Father Christmas there. You can snip out uh, the Star and Moons there as well. So you've got your nighttime scene, your daytime scene, your Christmas scene. So, so super versatile. And then lastly is the um, set which we saw, the Oh Holy Night, right at the start of the show, uh, the first card that Sarah made. We're also going to throw into the bundle 12 sheets of your acetate as well. Uh, and that is great when you consider it's a £93 bundle, $107 worth. Look at the platinum price today on launch day as well, where in my mind, I always think, well, launch day, you should be paying full price. Never happens here. Uh, you always get a huge discount on launch and platinum members get another 20% off as well. £58.39 or $67.16. Um, I cannot believe where the time has gone. We've got uh, just over 15 minutes remaining. So uh, we have got one more demo to squeeze in. Oh, yes. Thank you, Johnny. I'd forgotten about that in my three week break. We've got to do the demo of the show as well. Yes, so, of course. I'm building up I know. to the demo of the show, I potentially. Know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Potentially. I did mm -hmm. say I'll show everybody how to do this one. Yes. But instead of the little fairies inside, I'm going to do it with the, those woodland wood, lovely woodland animals. Okay. So here we go, guys. Let me just get this in. Make a note, pencil out. Let's write down all of these sizings. Okay. So this bit of cardstock, what you're going to do across the top, you're going to measure this one here is nine and a half inches, nine and a half 
by five and a half, okay? Nine and a half by five and a half. I've done it all in nice easy inches for you so that we everybody can do it easily, right? We're going to score at half an inch, straight down, right? Also at three and a half, so right down there at three and a half. Then I want you to come down at uh, six and a half. There we go. Perfect. And then also go to the side edge and take it right down at half an inch. Uh -huh. So that what we end up with is that's our little glue and flap on the bottom there. Yes. Right? Now, notice I scored on the top and I'm going to fold these over and I'm just going to take my little bit right along there and just give it a nice crease, but always folding it away from itself. Now, these bits on the bottom, what we're going to do is we're going to go up here and then up there, up here and up there, and then also you're going to come up there and then the edge bit from there, right? Uh -huh. So that's our nice base. So then we're going to bring in the dies. Have I got you out ready? Yes, I have. So all we're going to do is we're going to take these three. Now, I'm not going to make life difficult for myself and try and position these on the mat. I'm going to eyeball these. Which have you got there? Is that the woodland, is it? Uh, what's, yes, the woodland, yeah, woodland one. Okay. So this one here is your magical forest. I just call it the wood. See what you see. But what I've learned is we really confuse everybody by um, <laughs> giving everything to different names all the time so uh yes so we can't just call everything the same thing we can't just keep calling everything a magical forest or whatever i mean this is a magical forest but i think we'll call the last one something woodland so same concept uh, same beautiful style of artwork brand new illustrations to work in a triptych way yes. right so so you couldn't do this with a regular creator card you just have no option to because what do you do you, you oh yeah, well, you, yeah. Well, you just can't you physically couldn't make this card with a regular creator card yet it was born to be a triptych, right? And the size of these as well for a sort of regular is a five by seven, isn't it? Five by uh, seven card, a few people asking about the... Yes, um, yeah. five by seven, five yeah. by seven. Sorry, yes, I had to think about that one there. Right, let's have a little look. I'm just gonna try and squeeze this in and see if I can be cheeky and get this into my... Um, I'm gonna put it in the Gemini sideways because I have so little patience to put it through long ways. Right, here we go. Let's see if you'll go through. Oh, yes, squeeze that in. Because obviously it was just, it's nine and a half inches, isn't it? Where it's 29 inches wide. Back See what I did there? No, no, no clue what I did there, did you not? I've done what? this. Yeah, you've lost this. Look, I folded it over so it oh, fit through. I couldn't hear what you were saying. Cheeky. Oh, sorry, I wondered why you were looking at this funny. <laughs> I was trying to. I was like, yeah, he's got absolutely no idea what I'm doing. No, here. no, absolutely I can hear not you. at all. Didn't right? know what you were doing. So, right, all I'm doing then now, as I'll just tell you in case you can't see, is just poking all these bits out, Ben. Yes. And then what I'm going to do is do a little bit of colour. Now, I've done it again, look. That one, I found this last time, really intricate dye in the middle. Yeah. So if you want to do that really intricate one, and you want them to pop out really easily without having to poke these bits out, send it through an extra time, or send it through and then go and emboss it as well. Okay. All right? So I'm going to have to send it through an extra time, because I just... I want it perfect. Well, um, if, if, if a job's worth doing, it's worth it's, doing well, isn't it? Especially if you're building, you said this is like a crescendo, this show, you're building up to the fiesta resistance. Um, whilst you're doing that, Mary Lee says, as usual, this new launch is so different and innovative that I couldn't resist ordering these earlier. I love the demos, um, especially the, uh, the tea light holder. Um, Becky Hostler on Facebook saying, I'm learning so much today. So excited to get my eight orders. Eight, Becky. Eight. That is. Great. That great. is good going. That is good shopping. I uh, love the cards that are different and fun, says Terry. Um, Evangeline says, Ben, don't leave for such a long time anymore. Um, I, will, like, I can't guarantee that I won't oh. at some point go for a couple of weeks. You know, a bit of holiday, but I probably won't go for three weeks um, again. Um, no, I that. definitely won't, guys. I can't guarantee that. <laughs> the if you miss him that much... It just can't, can't be allowed, Ben. Well, the can't thing is, as well, previously up until this Monday, I was what we would call a freelancer, so I was kind of in charge of my own destiny. But now, I've signed on the dotted line, so now, I can't. Now Sarah's in charge now of my Sarah's destiny. Now Sarah's in charge. Bring him back in. Have him tomorrow. Have him tomorrow. <laughs> he doesn't need a break. Get him back in. Yep, that's what it's going to be like. Uh, why would I do it? It shows how much I love this place. That I had to, you know, sign on the dotted line, four days a week, no holidays, no breaks. Um, and a lot of people asking about Sarah's water bottle as well. Um, <laughs> It's, we don't sell that water bottle here. If Sarah, got, if Sarah got hers from the same place that I got mine, it's the it's the well known 
internet shopping place where you can get everything, you know. I don't know where mine came from, actually. All I know is one of the girls in the office had one, and I was like, wow, that's immense. And I came in a couple of days later, and I had one. Yeah. It's like, oh, thank you. I actually bought mine thinking it was like a regular size bottle, like <laughs> the one that we sell up when it came through. <laughs> it's like, what? <laughs> what? Uh, but yes, and a lot of people actually saw as well commenting about um, how great you are looking um, t today. <laughs> I think they, I think they mean how you know, fit and you know what it is though. Healthy you look. Every, everyone's trying to make up then for you just being like, oh, <laughs> is that what you're wearing today? I never. I did say that. I did say that. They're um, digging you out the hole there, Ben. They're digging you out the hole. Four holidays. They're saying, I would love to know Sarah's diet and exercise regime. Maybe it would help me to get a bit of her energy. Yeah, guys, you've just got to dance like, dance like 12, crazy. 14 hours a day. I've had a light day. So today, for those of you who missed it, I'm basically trying to do a full day of dance training, yeah. which my dance partner seems to think is only seven or eight hours. Yes. Excellent. Because uh, some of the other dance partners have not been that easy on their contest. Oh, really? Tell you. Well, seven yeah. or eight hours is easy. Oh, yeah. Poor Adam Peaty, you know, the Olympic gold medalist. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So so his partner, she's got him in eight to late today. <laughs> you know, like, and I think he can barely walk after yesterday still. So I've been getting all the gossip this morning. Oh, my he goodness. He pretended he needed a cup of coffee just so he could go and have a break about two o'clock. <laughs> Poor Adam. Uh, yeah, but he is an Olympic gold medalist, so he'll have the stamina. I mean, you think oh, I've got a lot of stamina. I mean, that's just got to be another level left to win two Olympic gold medals. Oh, yeah, absolutely years. right. Yeah. So, um, yes. So that is uh, that is our. What were we talking about? Uh, we were oh, yes, talking we about how you keep how you're keeping so fit yes. and um, so energy. So I'm doing so I'm doing that today. Being I was dancing until one, obviously, and then I'm working. I've got this show, and then I've got to go and do a board meeting with our US team. Wow. After I put the kids to bed, so half past seven tonight, and we'll go on probably till about eleven o'clock. Wow. So uh, yeah, that's that's how we're doing it. Burning the candle at both ends, but only for a few weeks, or hopefully months. If I do. Are you should just saying Sarah really does exemplify the term boss lady? Yes. Yes. She is bossing it. I think there's a Diana Ross song called Boss. Oh, is there? Yeah, I think mm. there is. Is there? Not one oh, we'll that I. Have to look. We'll have to look it up. Yeah. Not one just that I know. Just made a sneak of that there. Can, can I just ask as well, whilst you're colouring, and whilst I, whilst I don't want to forget. Oh, I've finished now. Oh, one quick question then. You know the glossy <laughs> highlights? Go on, yes. Oh, go on, I'll get it out. Because what I was going to do, Ben, was actually cut to one. Yeah that I had previously coloured early, ah. and I'll glossy highlight it up as we've made it. That's why so, I mentioned yes. it. Right. Um, May on. wants to know, can you add stick. glitter on top of the glossy highlights? Oh, yes. Have I got some glitter under here? <gasps> mm, no, I haven't. So, but if you add some glitter, yes, you're just going to, what's this under here? Not glitter, it's twine. Uh, you could just sprinkle a little bit of glitter on, guys, and it would look awesome. A glitter it would look gloss. awesome. Yes, glitter emboss. Right, I'm going to stick a bit of vellum behind these. You're all, you keep talking though. Oh, sorry. You're all right. Sorry. Yeah, you're all right. right. You, yeah, you can get okay. a word in edgeways. Um. <laughs> I, was, I was trying to tell you without telling you, you see. Uh, but I was just say thank you, Sarah, for the dimensions uh, as I'm coming in. Oh, I'm coming in for a live audition on the first. Oh! Yeah. Uh, and I well, listen, guys, if you're coming in for a live audition, to set yourself up for success, right? Yeah. Don't be coming in trying to do something this complicated back to front, <laughs> upside down for the camera. Honestly, pick something a little bit easier. Uh, We're not looking for someone who can like, yeah, we just look for people who can craft and chit chat. Yeah. So make your life easier. I want to make a Christmas Great display with a, fo a foliage cross dye. So we'll try your dimensions. The first, when's the first? That must be soon. That is, uh, uh, two weeks. Two weeks time. Two weeks today. Two weeks today. Wow. Um, yeah, we've got our, um, We've got our, uh, our craft factor going on. We had um, uh, Joey in today, didn't we? Earlier on on Wake Up Oh, here, brilliant. Which was um, really and good fun. And? Very good. Excellent. It Glad was, to hear it. It was quite nice for me, actually, because as you all know, um, Ionica was here and I thought I was coming in doing Wake Up Call and I arrived and they basically were like, no, get out, you're not doing the show. And yeah. so I, I got to sit in and watch it all and she was, um, she was very good. Very good. Oh, yeah. excellent. Well, I haven't seen it, but I'll have to watch have to it have back. have a little, little watch back later on. If you excellent. get time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, I'm going to go on with the glossy highlights. You want to see? Yes. Right, what should we glossy up the trees? So all you do is, can you see, dab, 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 dab on the trees and then a little bit of a squirt around. Now, while I'm glossy highlighting, do you want to do uh, me vote, Ben? I will. Shall I right. get your... Do you go want on. me to... Because you're gloss... You're, do you want me to get your card? Well, sorry, i tell you what, I'll pause for one second. Okay. okay. Right, so this is going to be demo number... Fuck. Four. Four. Fuck. Fuck. Is it? Four. One, two, three. I don't know. Should we count them? One. Eh! 
in one. <laughs> Is this one here? Yeah. Fabulous. Diorama one. card, right? Yeah. Number two was, was our easy. shaker card, which has been glossy highlighted up, so I can't stand it up. But can you see it's got? That's got the glossy oh, highlights. Oh, you see it on the trees. Yes, look at that. Starting to glossify up now, but I'm going to have to put that straight. So that was number two, yes. right? Number three was where we did... Was this number three or have I missed one out? I think that is it, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've done a lot of talking today, Ben. I know. A lot of talking, slower crafting, but we've done a lot of quite advanced cards, haven't we? Yes. So we did our fairies. Oh, I like Let's want to move this so that you can see the full effect there. So oh. that one there was number three. And then I'm going to have to put that flat as well because it's got the glossy highlights on. This is And tough. then number four is obviously this one here. Mm. Cast your votes now. Voting is now open. Go practice that for me. Yeah, it? voting is yeah. now open. Uh, you've literally got about ooh, three minutes to get your vote in on that. One, two, three or four uh, to get your vote in for the demo of the show. And of course, um, whatever is your winner on this show will go up against Craig's cards from Ooh, uh, earlier on today and of course pressure. later on because we're together on Colour Me Happy uh, a little bit later it'll be myself and Craig and also um, Ionica will be popping in on the show too by like the way the guys have eased me back in today didn't need me on the earlier show um, I'm only going to do a bit of the later show it's almost like they're trying to tell me something but uh, I won't take it personally you're all right mate you've turned on the dotted line now you'll that's it fine. you'll be it's fine it's too late now too late now. It's too late. We've got him for life. <laughs> Moved his family halfway up the country. Right signed on the dotted line. We kind of get rid of him now, guys. Oh. So don't start saying things, nasty things about Ben. Because <laughs> I'm stuck with him. Oh, dear. Because we love him so much. And I love you guys too. That's why, that's why I come here. Come here for all the banter. I know you're already joking when you say those things. I was being nice. Huh? Was being oh, no, nice. you were then. I know oh, you were then. Yeah, but when people take the mickey sometimes. It's all done in, you know, it's all done in jest and banter and good humour. We're like one big happy family here. One big happy family. Uh, by the way, we have literally got five minutes remaining on the show. If you want to get these glossy highlights that you can see Sarah using right now as well, fill up your baskets with those because they are flying out the door. And look, uh, we've sold hundreds and hundreds of these over the course of the last couple of hours. And, and again, just to reiterate with this, I'm sorry, if people are seeing these for the first time, you, you need to leave these to dry uh, naturally, yes, don't you? Yes, you do. I really shouldn't be doing three sides of this all at once. <laughs> um, because if you don't, it, it will drip. It's like a type of resin. It's, it's not a resin, but it's the effect of a type of resin. Yeah. So if you want to... Um, if you want that resin effect, then what you need to do is you need to leave it to dry and it'll go like glass on the top. And I'm literally, I mean, I'm hardly squeezing the bottle then, to be totally honest. And we're just getting that lovely kind of like glossy feel to the end of it. How long does it take to dry? That. Uh, right, so I would leave it overnight. Okay. Just like you would if you were doing resin. Leave it overnight. That's going to give you the kind of best finish on there. Good stuff. Good stuff. Right. Um, last chance saloon to get your votes in. Uh, I reckon you've got about another minute or so and then we will announce the winner of that and before you go as well I will recap on uh, everything that you can get in the main collection but that is so so super cute isn't it I'm and those glossy that. highlights are going to look great well, absolutely do you know that, that special effect on the tree there and then it's going yeah. to glossy love that and then that is the perfect size guys for you to pop a little tea light inside yeah and it's just all going to be flicker on wintry I would use one of the fake tea lights not oh, a yes. real one by the way oh yes yeah um, super cute, what a brilliant show, it is almost time for us to go, I'm a poet and I don't know it, uh, quickly just to wrap up on uh, everything that you're going to get in this collection, let me start with the two uh, that are um, sort of exclusive to us here on Crafters TV, so if you've seen um, the previous scenes on HSN and got those, these two here are the two that you won't have got, so the quaint village um, and also your charming church, so you can add those two in um, to your basket on a multi buy, two for £26 or two for $30, but you've seen with these, uh, the level of uh, detail that you're going to get and also the versatility that you get with these as well. Um, you've got that sort of creator card effect should you want to, uh, but then of course if you want to be able to snip into these you can. If you want to add extra elements with these and kind of really um, add to the dimension with them, you can. If you want to mix and match them too, lots of people have been chatting, can we mix and match these up? Absolutely you can. Wherever you want to go with these, uh, the possibilities really are huge. This one here is your magical forest uh, that we've just seen there with those gorgeous stags. Uh, you've then got on top of that one uh, your beautiful fairies and florals 
There's the beautiful Santa over the rooftops, which we absolutely love. That one's got that extra die in it there for uh, Father Christmas uh, to create that beautiful scene. And then lastly, uh, you've got your O oh Holy Night. 12 sheets of acetate included in that deal as well. And don't forget, it's launch day today. First time we've had it here on the channel. Should be over £93, almost $108. If you are um, platinum, £58.39 or $67.16. That is the price today. Well over half of the launch day stock has gone. And I'm not surprised. Oh, I am surprised because I, I know how big the stocks are for these shows. Big, big stock. Uh, but you guys have absolutely loved it. Uh, if you haven't yet checked out your baskets, make sure you do. You can continue to buy after the show. Uh, but don't leave it and forget about it uh, because this will continue to sell once we have finished. Thank you for all of the lovely comments coming through. Uh, Christine Mahoney, by the way, the glossy highlights also flying out. If you want to know how much the glossy highlights are loved, Christine Mahoney, I've just ordered six bottles. Yeah. That is the yeah. way to shop. There's somebody who knows it's not worth not being stocked up. Yeah, absolutely. Top shopping. Uh, Kathy says, another fab show. Thank you, Ben, Sarah, uh, Team Social and everyone at Crafters. What was the winner, though? What was the winner of the demo of Ooh. the show. What do you reckon, Sarah? Which well, I, I'm going to hope it was me number four because I'm already here to go with it. Was this? No. <gasps> number three? Oh, number one. <laughs> <laughs> number two. Number two. I number love two. Number two. Right. Oh, it was a great yes. card. Classy as. Yes. Classy as. Yep. We're going to shake, shake a card and look when the got now it's starting to dry up. So just because it's starting to dry within 15 minutes, don't think that's all right to not make it um to like stand it up now. No, I want you to go and leave it flat. I'm just standing it up for the camera to catch it. That is gonna dry flat, look absolutely outstanding on the shelf there and be a proper full-on contestant for today's card of the day. Absolutely right. What a brilliant show. I'm um, just say a big thank you to uh, Colin and Susie on the socials. We've been great. Um, uh, Johnny, of course, and Charlotte in the gallery as well. What, what's your diary um, then next? When do we see you next here? I think, is it, is it next Wednesday I'm in for the afternoon? I can't, I can't remember. <laughs> Would you like me to check? I have no idea. Today is... Friday. Friday. That is as much as I have learned. No, it's not Wednesday. Tuesday. Tuesday. Tuesday, but it's not on here. No, no, no. Oh. Tuesday, I'm in the office, but not here. Right. Uh, the following... I've got a craft with Sarah on Sunday. Who's booked in for me? Craft with Sarah on Sunday. Oh, brilliant. If not, there's still time to go and book on. You won't be able to book and get the kit sent, but you will be able to book and come along and do the live Zoom craft along with me. If you don't have a clue what I'm talking about, go over to the website and search Craft with Sarah, and you can do my live Craft with Sarah show on uh, Sunday. And then my next live show, I think, on here is on Wednesday the 20th. It's a week on Wednesday that I'm in. Got to practice all next week. Uh, well, listen, it has been fab. Thank you to Sarah. Thank you to you guys for uh, watching as well. I'll be back with uh, Craig and also Ionica uh, for Colour Me Happy in just a couple of hours. Go check out your baskets. See you soon. Bye for now.